Hey. Hello. Hmm. Wait, is it working? Is it working? Oh, wait, wait, wait. I think it's. I think it's working now. I think it's working now. This, ladies and gentlemen, is why. There we go. That's the one. This is why doing these checks in the beginning is so crucial, so we avoid things like that. Also, the music is full disclosure. There's this post on Reddit by someone called See Through Tooth Artist. It's the point is is a dancing spirit, but the song is catchy as fuck, so it has been stuck in my head all day, and now we're gonna get DMCA'd because that's how Twitch works. But yeah, so I was running late because I'm have problems and also because simply put um one of my lights is dead <laughs> and i think i was gassing myself out with whatever is inside mercury light bulbs so if yeah, you know it's a, it smells a little funny in here is all i'm saying but i should be fine might get a little mercury poisoning but yeah, my lighting is nowhere near as good as it normally is. As you can see, you can kind of see the green screen down here. Because I'm working off of one light, right? Yeah, so the way... The way... Okay, I'll do a little... I'll do a little behind the scenes real quick. Okay, you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? So that's my ceiling. You can see the green screen is just going nuts trying to keep up with it. So that's one light that I have. That's the other light that I have. Normally, I use two. Normally, I use two... But the the casing around the bulb broke and I didn't realize it. So it was like coming out and like pulling on the wires. And at first it's just like, oh, let's put back in. It's fine. But it, it got worse and I started smelling smoke and um, fire. So <laughs> that's fixed. It's good now. All right. Down, down, up, down, 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 up, up, down, up, 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 down, up, up. All right. Let's make sure we can actually hear. Okay, I think we're going to volume. Turn up a little bit. Yes. Yes. So you may notice that, like, you know, the green screen isn't quite working as well. I'm a little bit darker. But it is functioning. We are live. We're just a little less professional. Okay, there. So. With that, we can begin, because, as you said, we are running late. But that's okay, because um, today, today we're going to finish. I know it was supposed to be like, oh, you're supposed to play Tales of Rise today. I really wanted to finish this, because I know how close... Wow, look at that, so if I... Yeah, you can see the shadow in my hand. The shadow in my hand, because it's not two sources of light. The green screen doesn't quite know what to do with it. So I got like a little... I got like a little shadowy puppet hand to reach out and grab your soul. It's kind of a... I'm not gonna lie, that's actually... It's actually kind of a cool effect. I'm not gonna lie. But, anyways. Let's begin the episode. Yeah, I think I got everything. I just wanna see something real quick. Uh, episode select. Oh yeah, so it does show that, like, I tried to get back to episode... to who do you wanna call it? Yeah. Right, anyways. Let. Us. Begin. Hello everyone, my name is Max Olson, and Actual. welcome back to Resident Evil Revelations 2. On the last episode, we beat the game, and we almost beat, we almost, I want to emphasize that, we almost beat the struggle, which is Moira's DLC. Turned out she lived, even though she looked really dead. So, our goal today is to beat this DLC, which is like a challenge mode, beat Natalia's DLC, and then we'll see how spunky we're feeling if we want to try out the raid mode or if um, I made sure uh, Resident Evil Resistance is downloaded. Debate between that and Dead by Daylight, you know? 
Uh. Circuit for the floodlight. <laughs> just the, the light of God. Like, there's no camera. It's just white. Like, I, I might as well just put, like, a white piece of paper in front of my camera because it'll look the same. Yeah, this is, uh, Ungskis, I don't remember. He's come, old man. Mm, play some chips. Where are you going? My dad actually has, um... If you can move, Oops. leave. Trouble never comes along. So, um, my dad actually got... I don't know if it's that strong, but he got, like, a super-powered yeah. flashlight. He got, like, a super-powered flashlight. Get right and, like, out. it goes across. Our, our little... My parents' little farm isn't that big. But it, like, goes clear across the whole thing, and he loves playing with it. So, okay. I, I, we haven't used it in a while just because it hasn't been a need, but it, it was very funny to play with, just to be so like, to nighttime, daytime. He would put up with me just Anyways. as long as I pulled my own weight. I'm going to lower my own little volume a little bit, but it should still be plenty loud for you guys. Uh, you have to tell me if we need to raise, lower, or whatnot. Yeah, now I understand how this DLC works. I think we're gonna rock it. Long months. The problem is, we is when we know we're gonna have to deal with. I think they're in game called Revenants, but the the struggle, the Regenerator Boys, kind of a deal. Nice. So that way, yo, you see, you hear something rustle in the dumpster, and you could just like point the light of the sun on it and be like, "What is it? Is this some poor raccoon?" Alright, so how this mode works for everyone catching up is basically It's been about eight weeks now since oh. I lost track of Claire. The old man pulled my battered ass out of the wreckage and patched me up. I guess we'll let her explain it. As for the bracelet, mine never changed color. And I never turned into one of those things. Lucky me, right? Yeah. As soon as I was back on two legs, the old guy told me I had a hope of hunting. Basically, it was on me to kill my own food. Oh, shit. Can you use gold? Okay. Uh, um, more or less? No, no, wrong way, wrong way. Good. You collect on bullets. You run out, not my problem. Look, I get it. I won't be a burden. Uh. Oh, uh, in this episode, you need ra- Okay, I'm gonna move something around so I might break something. So, fair warning. Uh, in this episode, you need rations to retry a failed mission. Rations can be obtained by killing animals. The lack of sufficient rations for retry results in the game over. Meteor stated after this episode will be erased. Yeah, so this game has different stages, if you will. The big gate. I remember. Like, this game has different stages. And, yo, know, like, there's varying levels of, um... There's various levels, if you will... Of um. Yeah, yeah. Let's get this hunt on the road before you die of old age. Right, wait, hold on, hold on. Let's um. Can I go further? Hate using guns. This way. This is the way I went first time. All right, fairy. Baby. I know I have to eat, but. Ah, there we go. Yeah, so basically there's like a collection phase, if you will. Yeah, there's there's a collection phase, and then there's various combat phases. Now, during the combat phases, sure, we could like try to still find food, but yeah, this is a bit more chill. You know what the most drugged over fat rabbits in the world, as opposed to real life ones, where like they wouldn't let you within 3,000 miles they had their if they had their say and this one who just runs right at me so you post this thing uh he put them in silent on the point them to the corners and lights the floor ah, i got gotcha. you yeah so now okay so the reason we lost this last time i fully believe is because we accidentally screwed ourselves out of i know this See, food isn't as big as a problem as I thought it was the first time I played this. Because last time we only did one try, and we almost did it, but I screwed myself out of a pistol, and I didn't know there was an AK-47 until it was too late. So... Did the rabbit just... There's another one over there. Ah, I lost. I'm not going to worry too hard about it. Like I said, food isn't as big as a problem as you would think it is. 
Especially if we you know, play smart, play safe, and recognize that at any time, recognize that at any time, we can switch. Ah, shit. Oh, sick. You can eat those yep. insects if you remember to cook through. Yeah, there you I go. I think that's a really great idea. I'm not going to try. Joke's on him. him. I'm immediately going to try it. All right, we have enough food now. I'm not going to worry about killing animals anymore. Because um, I know some spiders show up here. Unfortunately, our melee is just nowhere near as good as um, Claire's. So we just kind of have to work with it. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to let you tag that. I think there's one more dog. Yeah, we're gonna be killing spiders, and that'll give us, even though they're not Man, spiders. Focus. All right. How did we're gonna be able to get passive food from them. Yep, yep, that's the big thing. I'm not gonna, like, that is the big, that is the big takeaway. We are not gonna screw ourselves out of the pistol, and we are gonna do everything in our God-given power to get the AK-47, because I, generally speaking, know where it is. Or at least I have a guide, and I have the ability I know now to sit there and restart the mission in case I fuck up. We're getting the AK-47, because the only problem is I don't know if um, I'll be able to carry four weapons at once. And I they might let me switch out the flashlight. I really hope they do, or else I'm going to have to sit there and make the hard decision. Should have done that. Shit, 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 shit. Yeah, all okay. right. That, that was my bad. I shouldn't have done that. I should not have used the shotgun. All right. Um, that's right. There's dudes in here. But there's also a good amount of ammo. Yeah, I'm going to let him figure that out, asshole. How about that? Ah! Unfortunately, we didn't find very many healing items. Ah, my aim is... Feels a lot more jumpy. I think it's just because I'm getting back into it. Hang on a sec. Nope. There we go. Yeah, okay, that feels a lot better. The time limit obviously is also going to be a factor, but um, it's not, I don't think it's as big a, a factor or it's going to be as big of a problem as the game makes it out to be. You know what I mean? I, I think it's actually, I think the situation is pretty chill if I remember right. But still, we want to stockpile on ammo as much as we can. Because future areas I'm just gonna tell everyone right now are gonna get rough so and also because we're gonna be taking on we're gonna be taking on this revenants it's gonna be basically uh it's gonna become basically a game of gambling it's yeah it's gonna basically become a game of gambling which I am not a fan of See, before I wasn't using, before I wasn't using him because um, I thought it was good role play, but now I'm like, oh fuck it, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna use him all day. Shit. Ah, damn it! I thought I thought it was loaded. He doesn't he doesn't do good reload discipline. But luckily for us, he, uh, old man here. I say he is so flaily. The old man here collects his own ammo off camera. Like, it's straight up said, like, he will find himself more ammo between missions, while Moira does not. And that kind of sucks, but that's also great because we can abuse that. We can we could purposefully run him out of ammo or, or leave him like one bullet 
So that way, especially against human shit. There's supposed to be a triangle nose around here. There totally is a triangle. Yep. Hold on. The reload on that ain't bad. I think there's another one walking up on us. No, I thought I heard one. I was incorrect. That's okay. Yeah, we just gotta collect as much of this shit. Good catch. Good catch. I'm going to collect as much of this shit as possible. Look at that. Look at that hot, nasty action. How you doing for health? Oh, you're doing great. You're nowhere near bleeding out. All right. Um, I forget. There's something in here I actually needed to do. Or was it was it really just collected for fun? It might have been just collected for fun. Because they do also kind of teleport you between areas. So, like, now's the time to sit here and be like... Did I just drop something? Now's the time to sit here and go, like, oh, let's combine this, and let's pass this, and pass that, and pass that. So I have all that, and you have all that. Boobity bobbity. I think. I think that's all we got in this zone, though. We got the important shit. I thought there's two pyramid no or triangle noses, but I guess not. Um, I forget also how big of an element looking for things with your flashlight is. To be completely honest. It might be a thing. It might not. I'm not sure. Redress! Hello! It's so good to see you. It's been a little while. We've got what we need. Can we call it a How's day? it going, man? Okay. This should be enough food. Yeah, we're just gonna Thank reload God. all our guns I quick. Can't wait to lie down. I thought that was it. Sorry, I couldn't take another second of getting muscled around by some man who thought he knew better than me. Why don't we find a way? It's because I am better than you, Koroska. No point. You need face reality. His house, his rules. I am better than you. Not yet. All I kept thinking was. All I kept oh, thinking about sorry to hear that. Actually. That night, mm. I had a dream Barry mm. was on his deathbed. He mm. looked really sad. Nobody mm. was with him. <laughs> Nobody to nag. He had no fire left. When I woke up, I realized I'd been crying. All right, next we go. All right, so next bit. I forget if the next bit is getting the shotgun, and that's what screwed us over. So we have to be really. No, oh, it's all good. It's all good. No, it's all good. I hope it was fun. We do plan on. Um, it may not be immediate, but we do plan on finishing that. Is just figuring out when works for her because. Um, so I don't work Fridays, but she does, which is why we've been doing the thing of. Um, Friday morning, or I stream Friday mornings just so we can spend more time together. I should make you go away. Okay. Right. Welcome back to the adventures of Widowmaker. I was about to say one shot, one kill, but. Fucking gorgeous! Shit. Caught me while I was reloading. Yeah, you sit there and make noises. Damn it. 
I was hoping you'd go down from that. Good, there's the other one. Come on. Come on. Uh. One, one thing with like just more duo streams in general, there's a certain amount of, I don't know what games to stream with her. Like there's a bunch we could pick up, pick from, but um, it's one of those situations of I don't want to abuse her kind of a deal. She, like she did say she was having fun though, so. I do not want to speak for her, you know what I mean? I don't have bullets for your small wussy American gun. I only have bullets for good boy, good boy Russian gun. Yes, good boy Russian gun, Max. That's that's what you were saying. Now right, we're gonna widow make her the shit out of this. I suddenly regret my life choices. Shit. Shit. Okay, gotta reload. Gotta reload. Let's see, uh? Make, uh, just you say the back of your actions. I, I would, that, 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 that's special. That's a, that's a date night ordeal. Uh? Actually, wait, hold on. Shit. I lied, I lied, this is a bad idea. Uh, I was gonna switch. I was gonna switch and get the flashlight out. This is bad. Shit. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, the disinfected, we'll just have to deal. Ah! I was actually gonna try to make that shot. I was gonna try and make it. Shit. Let's see, uh? Uh? Uh, both. Both, I will say though, and this is nothing against, this is nothing against Megan. She does not play video games as much as I do, or um, like as much or you know she doesn't get into them so there's definitely been some games we played together where she's gotten frustrated so it, it's me wanting to avoid that not because like she can't take care of herself but just because I don't want to like I said I don't, I don't want to abuse goodwill you know what I mean come on, come on, come on, come on. there you go ah damn it you're lucky bitch all right, reload discipline. Let's see. Ah. Uh... Oh, okay. I don't know. Maybe we'll... I will not promise anything, but I can talk to her about it. And I cannot promise it would be a regular thing either. That's not me trying to to tease. It's just like, let's be realistic. I have a weapon hidden. Nope. We'll last forever. I go 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 go. Shit. Bitch. Bitch. Pyramid head wannabe. Get your ass over there. You could survive a pallet to the face. There you go. That's it. Pummel party. Why do I feel like I've heard of that one before? Eh. Okay, good. Alright, go, 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 go. Oh, Gosh, guy, I thought you were one of them. Was going to shoot you. You are stealthy for shit. She's bringing herself out. It's okay. I am almost out of sniper rounds, though. Which is unfortunate, but that's okay. We'll just hand, oh shoot. We'll just hand him off and work with the no doubt shit ton of ammo that we are now leaving Kushka with. Yeah, look at all this ammo, it's great. All right, where's the goodies? Okay, the goodies are there, but first, let's see, cause I know y'all are gonna wake up Okay, I shot you. Okay, there. I'm gonna leave him with one bullet with the halo logic of um. I think that's yeah. The last of them. With the I'm gonna 
do that with the halo logic of um, if he has one bullet, that means he effectively has infinite bullets. Okay, and then we're going to quick as we can do that. And then we are going to... But, uh... uh but it'll probably hit me after you and I'll just drop you a list of Discord and does. Yeah, nothing wrong with that. Shoot. Okay, um... Hey, Mr. Snake. Oh, my... Asshole. I was going to let you live. All right. Um, okay, so here's what we got to do. We got to be really careful about this. Take the tourniquet. Take the tourniquet. Break this. Take the machine pistol. Take the shotgun and walk away. We are going to walk away now. So that way we keep the pistol. Damn it, damn it. Ass. 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 My aim there was garbo. Oh my. God, my aim was almost as bad as it is in real life. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest, real life, I'm not a very good shot. It's one of those things that, you know, you just gotta. You just gotta practice, and I've I'm not put in the time like I should have. My dad would be, ash my dad would be ashamed of me. It's fine. Oh shit! No. Wait, hold on. What? Rip cheer one. Rip cheer one. Rip cheer one. Oh. Oh, that's a you know, thank you, thank you, Red Dress. I really appreciate that. I thought I had something for five bits. Hmm. I'll worry about that later. It is not. It, it would not be polite. It would not be They're polite to side. worry about that right now. But thank you. That's very kind. That actually looks sort of perverted compared to the. Wait, what? Why perverted? Or like perverse? Like. Hey, fuck you. Okay. Shit. Oh! Okay. Good job with that knife. Shit. I was hoping I could. Okay, there's the health, there's the health, there's the health. Okay. okay. Um, shit. We're gonna want that. Okay, those guys are slow, so we can kind of... All right, come on, come on. We can work them into that. Now, unfortunately, there are the big boys that I probably could have used that on, but it's fine. It's fine. A oh, Steel City, hello. Uh... Oh, what's he doing in that gr- Ah! Ah! <laughs> okay, I see it. Yeah, I see it. I, 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 can, I can see that. But, um... Alright, so Joe is the rifle shotgun guy, noted. Yeah, it's a shame because, like, whenever I play video games, I always value precision and accuracy. Like, over power and stuff, right? Like, I want those- Ooh. Like, I want those headshots. That's how I- that's how I operate. I want those headshots. Wow, I just took out that guy with a crowbar. I... Bitch! Oof. Wow. Wow. This is going great! Alright, that was a bad sign. All right, how much ammo you got? None. All right. Probably a waste, but... Shit. 
go, 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 go. I can reload. Shit. Turns out fire fucking hurts. I need a whip up. Nope, get the fuck out of there. Okay, I know there's gonna be another one, so I don't wanna lead him to every barrel like, quite yet. In fact, there's probably, there's probably another one coming up my butt right now. So, oh, uh, uh, oh, archery's fun. My girlfriend's really into it. I did it a little bit, but I would never consider myself like anything more than a novice. I, I am insanely inexperienced with the bow, but it was definitely a lot of fun. I really enjoyed doing it. Especially when I see people with like the like, fuck my life. When I see the people with like the like 100 pound draws or the other like, that was a waste. You know, just like the insane, I know 100 pounds is that insane, but like, it always just struck me as a lot. Damn it. Shit. Ah. Oh, shit. Okay, okay, turn. Oh, uh, yeah, this is worth a grenade. Shit. Okay. We're doing snazzy. Life is good, my dudes. Life is good, my dudes. Life is great because I say it is. That's the rule. Okay, let's see if we can convince that guy to explode. You guys are saying things, and I want to hear what... Okay, that did very little. Okay, fine, you can have some too. Well, shit, if you could just both hold on a second. Fuck. Those... That might be death. Oh, wow, surprising. Okay, I still gotta heal though. Jeez, I got wrecked. Positively wrecked. Uh, uh, uh. Ah. That's unfortunate. I hope they get better, but I definitely know a few people um at their jobs, like I so my, my girlfriend was basically complaining about like um just different people at her work that be like oh I have COVID but they would like use that same excuse like multiple so I might have to restart I might have to restart that'd be real unfortunate but it's a possibility Nope, yep, yep, that, that's a restart. That's a restart, damn it. We weren't doing that bad, though. Not to talk smack, let's see about my work environment, but, um, or sorry about my girlfriend's work environment, but yeah, somebody who kept saying they got headaches and reported multiple times that they got COVID. It's like, okay, you're using this as an excuse. Got it. So hopefully that person isn't doing that. So where did they drop me? Shit. Shit. Okay, come on, come on. Okay, there. Alright, we're gonna work him a little bit just because the sniper. Okay. Ah! Damn it. Beautiful. Beautiful. If you could cover that guy beside me, I'd really appreciate it. Oh, shit. Okay. Um. Good. Ah, shit. I have to reload. Okay, ship up. Where's the guy? I'm pretty sure I hit Moira there. Okay, come on. That's one. 
Okay, real. Okay, we're gonna run this way now. Uh, kind of phone due to glitches. Oh, actually, Max, do you know there's a big black circle on the top right of the screen? Drop that many things I have. Use don't, use don't cover it. It's always there after. Wait, okay, wait, hold on. There's a big black circle on the top right of the screen. Drop down menus and any app used doesn't cover it. It's always there. It's always there after a boot. It is. Is it adware or just a glitch? Uh, uh, IT skills say first thing you should do is restart it. Try different apps. Try different opening it, like camera and everything. It, your screen might be busted, which is really unfortunate because that's what that sounds like, and I really hope that isn't it. It might be like some series of dead pixels and stuff, but that's just me making shit up. Um. Yep, it, it's all good if you're lurking a bit. I'm just happy that you're here. Uh, and have I played Tom? Would it... Is it on certain apps or is it just all the time? Because... Yeah, it's always just on top. If you can't interact with it, it can't move it around. Okay. That wouldn't be an app then. That would be... That could be a glitch. Or the screen is broken. It might be worth looking into. It depends on how old your phone is. Can't believe I just accidentally sidestepped that guy. Shit. Okay, we're gonna run this way. Run this way. Get some. Get some distance. Pray there's no one behind me. Let's be honest. We all saw that part coming. Come on. I'm gonna hope that they kind of body block each other a little bit. Oh. Uh. Might, it, it might be, I don't know, it depends on like how much, um, how much she cares about, like, having that specific phone. Oh, shit. Fuck. How much she cares about having that specific phone, or. I hope they didn't download anything bad. That would suck. Especially if she uses it for, like, payments and stuff. Shit. Oh, this is really bad. Ah, uh, I do not. Damn it. Okay. That's unfortunate. That's really unfortunate. But that's okay. We have more retries. And there's an opportunity later to get more food. And you know what? Today's stream is dedicated to being this shit. So, it's okay. Get that over. Shit. Okay. Oh! Oh! God, that was a whole lot of bad all at once. Yeah, some of this might come down to I need to be more okay with using my shotgun. Shit! God. Okay, that's more him ammo. Asshole, you're supposed to die. Okay, up. Okay. There's more ammo back there, though, so that's a problem. Oh my goodness. We're out of bullshits. Damn it. Damn it! I am rusty. 
Uh, uh. It's all good. Uh. Tooth FA is. Uh. Right, right, okay. Not gonna lie, two-factor authentication is one of those things that every now and then when it's brought up, I also forget what it is, so don't, don't, don't feel bad about that. I'm just like, what the fuck is, what the fuck is 2FA? That's a running boy. All right, shit, we're just gonna move, we're just gonna move. We're just gonna move, and if I can convince someone to go into that, we'll do it. Oh my goodness, my heart. Got him. We gotta run through these explodies. Alright, come on, girly. Come on. You can do it. I'm just gonna just unload whatever this gun is into him. Okay, come on, girly. Stay safe. Stay safe. Can't let these little guys swarm us. I can't tell if he's stumbling or if that's just the animation. I think that's him. He's not out. He's not out. Oh. Hard. Oh, no, 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 no. I can't hear that. That was rough. The old guy was pissed. Can't blame him, considering I almost cost him uh? his hideout. He told me to face reality. It's all good. Focus on surviving. And uh, NFTs, I, I don't under... I put... Okay, so, Jay, what I know I know you play or... Yeah, it was you. That, um... You play with stocks and crypto and stuff like that. My dad plays with crypto a lot. I'm... I put NFTs in the same box. I don't understand them, and I think they're dumb. Simple as that. I don't understand them, and I think they're dumb. If if you can't ex like just the idea of like this currency doesn't have a fit. I know I understand that our current Around currency doesn't really have like the gold standard as much anymore. Kind of but like this is literally a JPEG. It, was, it has worth because I declare it has worth. Reality. Give me money. You can imagine what that it's like ah. Uh, it was the old man's <laughs> idea to ramp up our hunting. Better to okay, so this is where we're gonna get the AK-47. Now, the guide told me. Island becomes more dangerous. That doesn't leave us a lot of time. The, the game told me firebombs will kill the creatures immediately. Yeah, it's like. The, the main reason I heard people could play about NFTs yeah, yeah. was like, you like you have to use like 1,500 different computers to help verify that you have Another the, one of these fuckers? you have like the one kind, one version of it, if you will. What if it does? Okay, we're going to test something because fuck it. Shit, they saw me. I was told that that shit would kill them instantaneously. I was told that shit would kill them instantaneously. So, the fact that it doesn't? A little bullshit. You were lied to? Yeah, well, there you go. Like I said, Another not not fuckers. something I'm going to pretend to really... No. I, I, I don't know it. I'm not going to pretend to be an expert. It, it strikes me as a farce. Okay. It always. Oh, shit, shit, shit. I don't know if I can kill the rabbit. I don't know how much or little sound I can make, and that bugs me. Shit, they saw me! Well. Well. That's what I wanted right there. And I'm dead. I am so 
dead. I don't know what's going to happen at the end of 10 seconds, so we're just going to find out. Hey, buddy. Well. Gosh, shit. There's a guy in a... The guy saw me when I opened the door. So, unless he, like, turns... Another one of these fuckers? Unless he, like, turns... I'm not sure how I'm supposed to... Okay. Because I don't have rocks to throw. Like, how am I supposed to... Do I have to wait for it to turn? Shit, they saw me. Oh, that was the one that saw me. Oh, look, there, there you go again. I I accept that I'm dead. I'm I might have to I might have to redo this, which is real unfortunate considering the other phase is pretty long. You know what I mean? It it is a long phase, so that sucks that I would have to redo it. Jeez, they run fast. Nope. Ah. Yeah, that's the other thing. Like, how am I how am I supposed to do that? Did I waste my firebombs previous like okay, fuck it. I think I'm gonna lose. And I need that gun. I need that gun. That gun is a hard and fast requirement. So, we're going to try this Another one more time. Okay, so, well, yeah. That's not the one that saw me. The one over there is the one who saw me. So, okay. So here's what we're just going to do. We have to wait for that guy. I don't know if you can see him. He's got a big bulgy arm. We have to wait for that asshole. To turn around because he's the one who saw me. That's what I get for trying to be fast. There you go. Shit, they saw me. This bullshit. Yeah, cause oh oh he has his back to me. Yep, okay. That is so... That is so dumb. How am I supposed to do that? Because, like, the fire... Maybe I have to, like, hit him directly. Fuck it, I'm gonna die anyway. That sure didn't seem to kill him. The guide straight up told me... And a dead end. The guide straight up said... Terminated. Ah, oh, okay, okay, okay. I want to, I want to show everyone this because this is annoying. Okay, I, I want to show everyone this. Okay, so. Okay. Um. Uh. Da 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 da. Uh. Da 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 da. da. All right. This is where Firebombs can understand one of the best against Revenant 2. You can throw them from stealth, and they will always one-hit kill the Revenant. From the start, head down and firebomb the first enemy. He'll fall easily. Head left and sneak down lower path. You wait down here for the enemy above and firebomb him, too. This gives you the whole middle area for free. You can get a barrel out here. You can get a barrel. What kind of barrel? The nearby shack has some assault rifle ammo in it, too. Now, the house to the right has one of the better items in this map. You can find a green herb outside the door and go around the house for a rabbit and another firebomb. Go inside the house and beware the revenant in the hallway. Firebomb him if you want the items in here, otherwise we should skip this house entirely. After he is dead, enter to find some disinfectant on the bookcase in the nearby room, the assault rifle with assault rifle ammo and some handgun ammo. From here, let's head to the bar. Yeah, in the front and on the bar, the Magnum Model 329. Hard choice on what to drop for this, right? In the back is a firebomb in the crate. I'm going to be honest, I'm not worried about the Magnum. I'm worried about the assault rifle. I'm worried about the assault rifle because that part with all the zombies, it what the, the power didn't matter. We have power because we have the old man. All right, so. Uh, yeah. 
then it's just a game of seeing how much shit we can get and we know where to run to. But it sucks because now we gotta do it again. All that time? All that time, right? Wasted. It's challenge mode, right? So. So we're gonna skip cutscenes. We're gonna skip cutscenes. We know what to do. We can be snappy about this. Yeah, we're not gonna worry about the Magnum. Yeah, we're not gonna worry about the Magnum. We're just gonna get the AK-47. Uh, more or less? Good. You collect arm bullets. You run out. Not my problem. Come Look, on, come on, I come on, come on. I won't be a burden. Come on, come on, come on. Challenge is finished. You go to Sawmill Entrance deep in forest. The big gate. I remember. Yep. It's very important you get there by sundown. Otherwise, the monster will have Kroshka for dinner. Yum, yum, yum. Well, thanks for scaring my appetite away. I help you, now you help me. Get this beautiful outfit. Yeah, so we gotta make sure... Yeah, yeah. Let's get this hunt on the road before yeah. you die. We gotta make sure in the sec but in the part with like that big fun. fight we cannot use our fire bottles like we cannot we have to save those for that bullshit phase and it is a bullshit phase there's, there's no there's no getting around that gall can you imagine if hunting was this easy in real life you just walk up on a rabbit Worlds appar apparently like rabbits are just like rabbits are just begging to die. God made them specifically to die. Oh, I heard a voice. I was like, "What the fuck?" All right, sitting snazzy. Got two and a third. We know there's a snake over here. I saw a mouse. Somewhere around here, there's a bug. Not even gonna try to melee, I'm just gonna shoot it. Alright. Ah, the snake's not here anymore. Damn it. The stink was a lot of meat. Yep, there it is. Ah, okay. Yeah, but not very much. Maybe I should have used my pistol. I think that's a really great idea. I'm not gonna try. Where'd it go? I felt like I had more food last time when I was here. I must have missed a few groups of rabbits, which is a pisser, but it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Because we got one bug. Got two bugs. We got dogs. Good shot. I know. Are you gonna let me shoot them or do you wanna complain right. some more? Okay, so we only unfortunately we only got about Man, I three and a quarter. Oh, sorry, again. three and three quarters. So we're gonna have to keep an eye out for rats, and that's okay. Ah, thank goodness I forgot about those two. Good, that's alright, good, that's a four. Just a little Little bit more. God, rats are surprisingly good. There's my snake. Boom. We're good. We don't gotta worry about food. Alright, now it's just a matter of playing with these guys as quick as we can. We're speed running this bitch. Oh shit, that's right. Ah, 
Ah, ah, damn it. Alright, uh. Waste of ammo. Waste of a heal. Maybe I could have, um. Maybe I could have, uh. Switched to him, but. I did not, because I was a fool. Bitch. My coding says I can't I can't leave the room yet. Get fucking wrecked. Ah shit. Quick scope your ass. Say don't get up. Don't get up or your ass is gonna get quick scoped again. I don't make the rules, I just enforce them. Alright, um gonna pass that shit. Pass that shit. Yep, all right. Just gotta do everything in our power not to use the fire bombs. And because, you know, we're warming up, our aim's getting better. So hopefully there won't be as many misfires. Like last time, you know what I mean? You follow me? All right, knock, knock, open up the door. All right, that's all we got. Reload this bad boy. Oh, right. Let me just pull up my good girl petticoat so it doesn't get dirty. When you are done, head for gate. Yes, sir. Alright, um, I thought there was more ammo there. Oh, 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 oh. Would rather not miss that shit. We see who runs and who doesn't. If they smart, they leave. If they're not so smart, we shoot. You'd be surprised how simple life is that way. Shit. Shit. Thank you for the save. Alright. Can we want that red herb? This is box last time. Decoy bottles. Nice, nice. Okay. Max, you can knife those guys. That's true, I can. Done. Sorry, maybe I like sniping. Bitch. 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 She's fine. Bitch. Bitch. How you feeling about life? You're regenerate. Alright, we'll just I just gotta I just gotta drive gotta drive the old man for a little bit, you'll regenerate. Especially because that was basically the end of them I think there might be like one dog in here shit Just... alright yep we'll regenerate we'll regenerate especially cause we're like right at the end so you know we're gonna we're gonna get healed through the cutscene anyway so it's all good not gonna waste nothing on it. All right, now we can take the time to pass, 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 pass. We'll combine that. We'll pass two of them. Pass, pass. Look at all that ammo. She's sitting pretty. Life is good. I die from fall damage. And we call it. We got it. what we need. Can we call it a day? Okay. This should be enough. Thank God. I can't wait to lie down. Lie down? This is it. Wow. Thought I heard something. Educational. Okay. Same as before. That was it. Same as before. I couldn't take another second. This next round, we. Soggy. When the humans show up. We lead with our man. 
Then we lead with our man, light him up, and then we need to be more comfortable with um, using our flashlight and switching to um, switching to him. We we'll get to that ammo. You make him go away. I'm sorry. Just help me out. I should make you go away. All right. Let's just lean over this. So we can at minimum see them coming. Even one of them gets thrown. I know. Just cover me. Cover your mouth, and I will cover you. guy we just gotta load into. Oh, that guy's at a sprint. He's like, oh, hang on, I gotta. Oof. Oof, that there. That was a lot of running. Alright. We're gonna try to juke this man as we go look for supplies. Alright, old man, lay into it. That position back there was advantageous, so I'd rather not lose it, all right? Hey, did, did you just... Did you just make us lose that position? Why, well, yes I did, Koroshka. Why would you ask? No reason. Reload, 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 go, 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 go. Alright. Yeah, go, 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 go. Oh, she. Okay, good. She's, she's like barely hurt it, if, if at all. So, awesome. Great. Pass her more ammo. Look for dudes. Okay, that was the arm, but you know what? Stunned him enough for that, so. Shit. Shit. There you go. Okay, oh, shit, we got, we got, good job. We gotta take care of that guy. Switch. Every time I do that, I really think that that explosion is gonna kill him. It never does, does it? Okay, we see one guy run up there, one guy run over here, let's take Switch. Not my problem. Okay, nice little concentrated bursts. A few in the chest to stun. Line up that head. One remaining. Perfect. We will sit here and we will take our sweet ass time. Boop. Go, problem solved. Reload. Discipline. How hard are you? You'll be fine. Yes. Or we'll come. Okay. We must move or we have the chance. We gotta get that shotgun. Right. We gotta get that shotgun. I have dry skin on my feet. Sorry. How hard are you? This is what happens when you Shit. I have a weapon hidden further in. This is okay. But we must get it. We're not gonna last long in a rat run like this. Fun. Correct. So we get in, get out. <laughs> right, unfortunately, in checking that shit, I did waste some time. So, but it's fine. We'll live. Have to wait for him to wake up. He goes right back down. Crouch. Get that extra. That extra, what is it, 20% damage? Shime in the Jimmy. No, 
Okay, there's an explody guy over there somewhere, but the problem is, is oh shit. The problem is, is we're almost out of rounds. So, would rather not if possible. But I recognize I'm probably going to need to. Nice, all right. Is there anyone else I can snipe? Yes. Shit. There you go. There. Problem solved. Alright. Get that crouch. Look at his abs. Really? Fuck. Shit, the tourniquet. Oh, God, I'm burning through those things. Okay, and you're out of ammo for that shit, so I might as well just go over here and wake all these guys up. Might as well. So I can do that. Yep, very nice, very polite. Very nice, very polite. Shoot the snake. Okay. Okay, can snake me. I got my gun. Shot or two, he'd falter. Now right, we're just gonna hold here, try to use up pistol ammo. Shit. Hopefully that respawns. I generally did not mean to shoot that. Alright, so we're just gonna move. God, that is a really good tool against those guys. Nice and polite. Sure. No shoot. <gasps> Fuck with the tourniquet. Shit, I'm so sick of that. It's literally a Fuck you, you're just gonna have to live with the status effect. Okay, um. Okay, and I'm gonna have to deal with that now. So if I don't deal with that, I'm gonna keep running past it, and it's gonna keep ruining my life. Hey, can you. Oh, I fucking hate that so much. Uh, where's the other guy? Okay, there. Like, I need to go. Shit! I... Fuck. That almost sucked. Uh, almost, it did. Shit! Fuck this. Oh, I can't heal because I have that shit on me. Oh, I also can't heal because I don't have anything to heal with. Lovely. I'm getting my ass handed to me. Problem is, I did that, and you know, good job. Actually, wait, that's right. If you just run, 
Yeah, if you just sprint through it, you can set them off, but you have to dedicated sprint. You can't... Well, that's worth it. Why didn't none of them go off? Eh, that might not have been worth it. The reason I originally lost that thing was just because I didn't have high enough firepower with the sniper rifle. I think it was. Fucking take it to go. Fucking. Take it to go. <sighs> yeah, headshots don't mean shit. Fuck you. I'm like trying to like make some distance like I'm supposed Supposed to. Okay, okay, okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Three, two, one. It actually worked out. Okay. Can I remote heal him? Nobody can do that. I can do this. the Lord and pass the ammunition. Bullshit. And we're back to running. Because I... Well, oh, shit. What's up, asshole? Alright. That's right, they take a second to set. Just gonna... Come on, come on, come on. Come on, 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 come on. Shit. And we keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Shit. And like that. Oh, fuck. Ah. That takes so long. That takes so freaking. And I can't shoot anything in the one phase because if I do, they're gonna go, oh, they didn't see you. Ah. Okay, uh, that worked last time. I guess that's because I hit him in the head. God, it's annoying. If he explodes on the old man, it's not my problem. Okay, come on. 
Ah, shit. Ah, fucking deep wound again. It never freaking ends. So I have to wait for the status to freaking go away. I'm just gonna keep moving. I have to wait for the status to go away. Because I'm wounded, I'm not moving fast. You'll be fine, probably, right? Okay, there. And then I can heal. Then we can take a moment to load our guns. Oh my goodness, that is so... That is so bad. Okay. Okay, asshole's gonna, like, jump down from up there. Yeah, I don't know why he doesn't know reload discipline. If anyone in the room should know reload discipline. Okay, everyone jump down. Everyone jump down. Everyone jump down. Everyone jump down. A little more. A little more. A little more. Beautiful. Oh, shit. Shit. Okay. Now she has to run again. Now she has to run. And I'm going to have to take that. Wait a second. Are these last two? Holy shit. Are these last two? Holy shit. Did I get that right? No, 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 they add more, right? Good. I'm gonna have to switch to her, and she's almost dead, so I'm gonna keep her as far away as possible. As you know, in real life, if you don't shoot a shotgun from three feet, oh, thank God. I think it's over. What are you thinking? You want to destroy everything But yeah, as you know, in real life, if you don't shoot a shotgun at someone at point blank, you might as well be throwing confetti at them. Fuck. Can't blame him. Okay, so. And now for the next phase. We have a shit ton of firebombs, which is great, but... Okay, so the guide says that I could do this from stealth. Okay, the guide says I could do this from stealth. We have... Well, okay, we have four retries, so really we have five tries, if you will. And no ammo. We have three. We have three firebombs. Meet me by slope, yeah, leading free fire. to the <laughs> I will change situation from above. <laughs> we have three firebombs. Be careful, Kroska. We have three yeah, firebombs. Yeah. You too. And practically speaking, no ammo. Another one of these fuckers? Okay. But what if it does? Okay, so here's the firebomb. Direct. Okay. Hit. Shit, they saw me. That's 
The guy and the guide must be playing it on a lower difficulty because... Because I do that shit and it doesn't flip and work. That, that has to be it. I do that shit, he dies, but they're like, shit fam, they saw you, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if you're... Oh my goodness. That is so annoying. That is so annoying. If you're supposed to do that from stealth, how are you supposed to do that? Evgeny. These fuckers? I'm gonna try it again. But what if it does? Like, I'm going to. Okay. Look. Shit, they saw me. I'm in. S I was in cover. And you can see the guy does die. The guy does die. It's just, it doesn't matter. You attacked them, therefore they see you. How are you supposed to do that stealthily? Am I too close? Do I need to like lob that shit? Do I need to like maximum range lob that shit? Oh my goodness, that is... That is so annoying. I'm going to have to do all of that again. If I have to do it all again, I will do it at a lower difficulty because this is infuriating. And Another the reason it's infuriating is because I'm doing it right. That's what always gets me. In oh, shit. That's what always gets me in a game when, like, I fail even though I did what I was supposed to. But what if it does? Oh, I can't turn because it's cutscene. Okay, look. Okay. Maximum range. The only one who saw me died. The only one. No one else knows where I am. <sighs> I'm going to have to do this on a lower difficulty just for sake of getting this done today. That is so dumb. That is so dumb. Because... What else am I supposed to do? Like, seriously, what else am I supposed to do there? Nothing. Like, oh, Max, just don't engage. Just sneak. I did that. And each time I've died. But what if it does? And I'm mad because they're like, because the guide's like, just throw a fireball. Boop, boop, boop. And I'm like, oh, awesome, great. And you're like, that, that's, you know, wonderful. Of, of course, I would love to. Do you have the ammo to shoot at the rabbit? And you're like, awesome, great. I'll throw a firebomb. And then the game isn't just like you have to get to the area without dying. No, it's you have 30 seconds and... You can see. Shit, they saw me. This game's bullshit. This game's bullshit. Ah, uh, this is bullshit. I think I've talked about this before, and I understand why it's important. But in stealth game, I mean, it—it it really is the same problem that I have with like Alien Isolation and other stealth games. Games where if you're not allowed to make mistakes. I like Another stealth games where numbers? you're allowed to make mistakes. Because. Like, okay, Max, how would you fix this? You must keep the time mechanic. How would you fix this? Okay, simple. I would give about 15 seconds. Like, okay, I would I'd, I would explain to the player that it's like, okay, here's the deal. They can see you, but you have to kill them okay. within 20 seconds. And if you don't, they will call swarms. 
Look how, look how subtle that is. That is a matter of him turning 15 degrees and the twitchy asshole twitches enough as it is. So how are you supposed to be able to know, not to mention he has two fucking heads? Is that my window? Is that not my window? Who knows? He's twitching. There, is that my window? Does it matter? 30, you have 30 seconds. It's physically impossible to get there in time. You just, you can just go fuck yourself. Yep, and I took a hit, which means I'm not sprinting, which means I died, because even though most of these zombies haven't seen where I am, the game says, and I quote, you can go fuck yourself. And also your dash isn't unlimited, so even if it, so even if it was, and there was like the slightest chance in the world that I was just about to make it, holy shit, I think I made it. Okay, this should cover us. Head back. Yep, this should cover us. Great. Mixed in with the supplies, we found a document. No ammo. Of islanders who had been taken to become test subjects. When the old man saw it, Ugh, God, his face turned so... white as a sheet. Yeah, it he definitely. Knows. If I'm, I have, I have no food. So if I lose this again, I'm just gonna lower the difficulty, because was his missing daughter. That's that was that's bullshit. And you know, you know what we're fine next, right? Now we have to fight those things. Oh, sorry. Okay. So if I if I was put in charge of that and they were like, you have to make it a time stealth segment, I would basically explain that. It's like, okay, so here's the deal. Their hearing isn't very good. If they see you, you got about 15, 20 seconds. And if you can kill them in that time frame, they won't call anyone. should have figured that out about my own dad a little sooner and cut him some slack. You know what I mean? Explain to them that it's like, okay, for whatever reason, they're practically deaf. So you could shoot a gun to kill animals. But if they see you, you're fucked. And then I would I would want to make it much more obvious that like this is where I'm looking, so this is where I'm looking, because they're endless going. Groshka was good enough. It's like how are you supposed to be able to tell down, where they're looking? I wanted him to ask. <sighs> I didn't believe we would find his daughter. Oh, sorry, sorry, I shouldn't have done that actually. And what's worse? Let's go find out what happened to Irina. Huh? Yep. Here it is. A guy that you can basically only take down if you have a shit ton of ammo. Those things are coming We better take them all out. You have to have you have to have copious amounts of ammo if you want to take this thing. Because it's a game of gambling and prayer. Great, great, good, 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 good. By the way, no health either. See? No health. Closest thing I got? Firebombs. That didn't kill him. That took forever. So I go pop. Nope, it wasn't enough to break through his leg. Was not enough to break through his leg. Was not enough to break through his leg. He's getting murdered. Okay, great. That was, though. So now I can take my big-ass sniper rifle. It's big and powerful. And actually do something about it. While she gets her shit rocked. Good. That's it. Fuck you. Fuck you. I don't have the ammo to play this game. Which sucks. Because... The big boys and the spitters are gonna come and they're going to ruin my life and I don't have what I need to play. Yeah, I don't have what I need to play ball. Okay, great, good, good. I apologize for being pissy. But I'm pissy. I think I'm justified in being pissy. Because this wiggly get. Nope. That's not it. Yeah, it's gambling. Like, I, I, just, I can't get over that. I can't get over how these guys are gambling without Natalia. You just have to hope that you hit the right spot and if you don't sucks to suck and if you do great oh by the way here's something uh, at least it's only one of them okay 
Yeah, so we're just gonna... We're gonna leave you alone, movie girl. But Max, use your explosives to... To break away the tetrackles. Fun fact, this guy has instant kill moves. I think he's following me with those instant kill moves. Oh look. Oh look, there he is. He's charging it up. Fun fact, it's also kind of a dash. I have to sit here and shoot him in the kidney. As he blocks it. Oh look. Oh look, it death. Okay, come on. Come on. Me, me, me. Yeah, good, good, good. Is that death? No, it's not. Okay. see where he is. <sighs> How infuriating. Finally. Yeah, but now we're going to have to deal with... I forget if the next area... If the next area has just more of them or what. But... We... Yeah. We're not leaving till we find out what happened to Arena. I'm not leaving till I stop coughing up blood. It's gonna be a minute. And there's nothing here. And I broke my leg. Yeah, at least that's the upside of this next area. That, um... Obviously, Evigny's weapon is incredibly good. But I can get away with doing that. And that's valuable. Great. Yep. The submachine gun. The submachine gun is going to be incredibly valuable. But first, I need healing. See? Just. Just nice. Nice clean. We just don't have health to play. That guy moving freaking fast. Sucks that I have to immediately use it though. There we go. Okay. Like I said, I still, I genuinely like fighting these things. You know, it feels good being able to mow down tons of them. And yeah, just that feeling of like, well, shit, how do I escape? Because, you know, individually, they're easy. It's because there's 50 million of them. That's why there's a problem. They start coming from all directions. That's, that's the fun, in my opinion. Still, though. Four bolts to the head. It's a lot. Great. That shit! Look at all that damage right from the get go! Okay, I only got one of them. He's fine. Right, there's that magnum ammo. Move, please. Move, please. Oh, great. 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 How's that working for you? Hey, Moira. Hey, Moira. How's that working for you? Great. Max, you butt hurt a little. 
last time, or the first time I did this, I found a ton of ammo in that area before getting caught. And this time, I got fucked out of most of it. So, I hope everyone can forgive me if I'm a little... If I'm a little pissy as a result. At least with this gun, it's, uh, gun, it's a double tapping adventure, so... Remember last time when I had like, I was like nearing a hundred rounds of assault rifle ammo, cursing out my own existence. And I think I was like getting up there with pistol too. There you go, there you go, there you go, okay. So we're not gaining ammo, so that's a problem. I'm beginning to wonder if I can't like, do that nice little double if I need to give them time to think about their lives and do their little animation. Like if I need to like do a thing where I like shoot one, shoot another, shoot one, shoot another, like Yeah, yeah these are just party little assholes. There must be like a certain amount of like random number modifier too of um each shot does between like I'm just gonna make up numbers, like between five and ten damage. And if each one of these guys has like 30 hit points, you know what I mean? Area's clear. Let's keep going. Alright. A little better. Wait, what game are you playing? Oh, division, you mean. No, we're we still have to we still are gonna have to deal with the Yeah. He has no sniper we're ammo. He has no sniper ammo, and we're gonna have to deal with a whole bunch of guys whose primary ways of getting murdered. Great. Fuck you. Look at this breakdancing asshole, and you tell me. I was about to make the. Do you see that bitch? You see that shit? I'm act. We're going to a lower difficulty. Ah, uh, that was bullshit. It's bullshit that I can't. Uh, it's bullshit that I can't do the um, that I can't be stealthy, get the AK-47. Because if I was able to get ammo, I would have been able to deal with that shit. Ah, oh, that's so dumb. Yeah, new game, casual. Fuck you. Fuck you for saying casual. And make me feel awful. The game is going to be like, don't worry about the food mechanic. You can restart as much as you want. The food mechanic is for funsies. It's going to make it so every time you punch, it destroys a building. It's been about eight weeks now since I lost Casual. You Fuck you. Uh, That's what I feel like when it's just casual. It's just like, fuck Good. you. I lost that because of bullshit. Look. <sighs> Pretty sure you could have had it by now, but maybe it's just me. I get it. I won't be a burden. Wait, you say Wait, wait, wait. I I Red Rose, I can't tell if that's you saying I suck the big ass or if that's you saying I should have been able to do it already. It's very important you get there by sundown. Otherwise monsters will have crow stuff for dinner. Yum yum. Like my first time through, I almost had it. My first time through, I almost had it with yeah, missing yeah. a gun. I was gonna say, like, damn. Yeah, my first time through, I almost had it, like, while missing a gun, but a big part of that was I was able to explore, and I hate that you can't get that weapon without ruining everything. That too, yeah. I missed with an RPG. And it was getting late, and I was like, okay, I need to. Yeah, like. It's not like, Max, you suck at the stealth games. And I, like, look. I turned my head to look at my entire playthrough of Melgar Solid, where, like, you know, at first I had a little bit of a hard time, but I started getting really good at that game. Yeah, I bet you didn't see that shit coming me sniping with a some machine gun. Sombra up in this bitch. Damn it. Yeah, if this... Let's see. 
A rabbit literally no clue. Yeah, rabbits are magical. Like, they have a death wish and they want... Like, they have a death wish. They don't have a concept of humans. But they can, like, face through reality. So, they have no natural predators. That's why they walk around so freely. They're just like, fuck you, gonna do about it. Like, oh shit, you have a gun? I thought that was a rabbit. Wasting precious ammo. Getting tilted. Getting tilted. But, like, if the stealth worked like I think it was intended to, I think it would be better. But then I would just want them to have an answer for the revenants. So to make it so it's not gambling. Like, it would have been so easy to, um, the rabbit's there. The problem is the bug is here, too. Ah, uh, I missed the rabbit. But, um, it, like, oh, shoot. God, seeing that bastard's horrifying. God, that thing could take bullet. But, um... Okay, so things Max really would change. I'm not gonna try. Number one, fix the stealth segment. Just make it so it's more clear about the stealth. You know, if you insist that we have to have it, fine. But you gotta make sure it's obvious where they're looking. You know, there are. Okay. You know, their arms, their arms can twitch all day, but their head never can. You have to make sure you know where their vision is. And I don't care if you have to set up a vector. I don't care if you have to have a blood stain and, like, dead by daylight. You need something to make it clear. Because otherwise, we're guessing. And we don't know the full extent of, like, how far or how little our range is. And it is so difficult in a stealth game when you don't understand your limits of, like... Are you gonna let me shoot them or do you Look, wanna complain some more? They're they're long dead. You know, it is so hard in a stealth game when you don't know what you can and can't get away with. Because then either you get bold and then you lose, or you or you be overly careful and you take eight times as long as the game ever intended for you to. Alright, there you go. But um the other thing Okay, the other thing I would do. I would make it much... Oh! I, I thought I could leave the snake alone. But fuck me, I guess. There you go. Um, the next thing I would do. I would make it much more obvious about the guns. Or make it just... Make it more obvious that you can get each gun. And if you miss the gun... Or in between segments, make it so you can rearrange your guns. And in between, um, actually, no, just, just make it more obvious about the guns. Like, make it so you have to walk by them. Or that they're just given to you. Something. Because they're so easy to miss. And then make it so that whatever gun you don't choose, you don't get ammo for. Because that's also the world's shittiest feeling. When you're like, oh, okay, well, you know, I, I see the AK-47, I see the Magnum. Here's, oh, also, I would make it so Moira's melee isn't so shitty. Because, trust me, it's shitty. Let's see, um... Oh, you straight up have infinity ammo for the handgun? Jeez. But yeah, that's kind of... That's a small, that's a small, that's like a town's arsenal. Yeah, exactly, I would totally do that. I, I, that is what I would do because how shitty is it if you're like, okay, I found the weapons. This is great. Good. Um, I'm going to, I'm going to work the Magnum. I think the Magnum is the most tactically sound decision. All assault rifle ammo. That's the game flipping you the bird and there's nothing you can do about it. Good girl. Oh, and then the, I don't know about the last thing, but the other major thing I would do. So Engive or whatever the fuck, however you pronounce it. Wow. Wow! Wow! I just knifed a rabbit! Holy shit! I'm a god! 
But, um... Uh? Right, like, obviously it's not realistic, but, you know, how much of video games is completely unrealistic? Boxes with ammos in them. Box, you know, boxes with ammo in them. That's not even addressed in the fact that we're fighting zombies or that, you know, I'm not getting tired or like the recoil of the gun or blah blah blah. It's not even addressing that shit. Or that's that's how scoping works. But um, there's things we can let go in the name of fun. You know what I mean? Like, you know, we're trying to have fun here. And I say this as someone who loves Dark Souls, which a lot of people say, like, Max, you have to let people have fun. Dark Souls isn't for everyone. But still, like... <sighs> it's just so annoying. But, um, what's the other thing I was going to say? Oh, so... They never address how the fuck Angie here has survived for so long. And I think what they're supposed you're supposed to think is like, ah, oh, it's because he's just like that insanely good of like a of like a wild man. Like he is just so skilled, so in tuned with his hunter instincts and how to survive in this island that mysteriously and always generates ammo and is so unbelievably full of zombies that you can't go five feet without tripping on eight. But you know, whatever, he survives, right? But there's no explanation on how he survives. And I get that they can't give him Natalia's power because that's Natalia's shtick. I would say fuck that. Let him have Natalia's power. Straight up, let him have it. Because that way, you could still have the working together aspect of like, okay, there's, you know, there's revenants or whatever. But we have to like isolate where the weak point is. How do we do so? Switch to Engie would still have to call it out. Engie would still have to call it out, and Moira would be able to take them down. Oh, but Max, that would make the that would make the revenants too easy. Ba, ba, ba. How how would how would how would it be difficult if there if you didn't have to guess randomly? Add more. Just add more. Okay. It's what they did in the main <laughs> campaign. It was like ah shit. They're, like we want to make things we want to make things difficult. So what do we do? We keep throwing zombies at people wow. different combinations of zombies different environments make it so you have to stress out and go <laughs> I thought that was it. I couldn't take another second of Getting muscled around by Some man who thought he knew better. So yeah in conclusion in conclusion, I'm butthurt, but I'm butthurt and I think if the controls and the mechanics were tightened up just a little bit, and if there was a, just some quality of life changes, this would be a fun challenge mode that had no extra bullshit that ruined it for you. Unfortunately, at this current juncture, there's extra bullshit that ruins it for you. Ra ra ra. I should make you go away. I mean, it is a big part of this channel. Half the point of this channel is. Hello, phone. Wells Fargo, Wells Fargo, we value your insights. You bought a car. All right, whatever. I recognize when I like get ranty like that, I really do. I probably do sound very ungrateful and very much like a, uh, nice. Very much like a whiner. And I, ah. And I, I could take a step back and acknowledge that. Yeah, uh, I could I could take a step back and recognize there's a lot of things that are just like, well, Max, you kind of suck at the game. I can accept that. But when it comes to, like, game design shit like that, that's the stuff I do want to talk about. I do... Oh, I almost got his back there. I do want to sit down and talk about it because... If anything, whether it's me making the video game or... Yeah, whether it's me making the video game or if I'm part of a team or if whatever reason, there's, like... Someday there's a game developer watching this shit. I want to help provide that insight. Not because I'm some like genius that knows all game design, but because it's like we can look at clear examples and just talk about what we think would make it better. Also, if a thing says F to pick it up, it should be fucking F and not click. Especially when click is how you use your knife. So how are you supposed to break the say environment? Good job. Good job. How are you supposed to break the environment if you're trying not to pick things up 
because you're worried about wasting ammo. Or because you're trying to get the right gun so you don't waste the ammo. Because apparently in this mode, once you lose it, you lose it forever. She is never coming back. She will never write you. It's just freaking gone. The light, the light mechanic is a fun mechanic, except it takes too long. The disinfectant and the tourniquet mechanic is interesting, but it becomes really annoying when someone taps you once and you get deep wound and there's nothing you can do about it. And then you just have to decide, well, I guess I'm dead because I don't have a tourniquet. Anything else we should whine about this game? The thing is, okay, overall, I do like this game. <laughs> That's the thing. I will sit here and I will shit on it. But overall, there's a lot of things I really do like, okay? I think the enemy designs are fun. I think how they work is fun. It just sucks on survival mode that the game decides, like, oh, yes, you, to kill them, you basically have to, like, saw through this wall with this pen. That's how many bullets it takes. Like, and, like, the story was interesting, the villain was interesting, the working together mechanics with Natalia was great. Moira, eh, but Natalia, it, it, Natalia was fine, it was, it was totally fine. Moira, as much as I make fun of her as a character, is, oh, you can't headshot them. Natalia, as a character, as much as I make fun of her, she's totally fine, she's, she's fine. It was great to see Claire, Claire is a fun character as well. The boss fight with the uh, with Neil, it was it was fine. It was good. These pyramid head looking motherfuckers, well they're pyramid head looking motherfuckers, but come on. They're nice and simple besides that deep wound bullshit. That deep wound bullshit is fun fact. Bullshit. The environment's interesting. It's cool how they reuse it. Some might say that's padding. I loved Barry. I like how the final boss fight wasn't just fight another titan. It was like an almost a stealth segment. I thought that was very cool. It's not that I can't, it's not that I'm like not allowing myself to say nice things. It's just, there are different design choices that I'm like, I, I feel like this, this could have been addressed. Like. Max in the Max in the testing room or Max in the design room would be like, hear me out. Let's let's add some quality of life bullshit. Because everyone at the end of the day appreciates quality of life bullshit. No one in their right mind is gonna like look back and be like, man, all this quality of life shit sucks. All this accessibility and make it so I could customize my experience to be sucks. I'm ranting. I'm sorry. Boop. Boop. Didn't they give me like five minutes total? Yeah. See that shit? I caught that in mid freaking air. I would like to talk about that for a second. That snake. That snake jumped and I caught him in midair. What I'm basically trying to say is I'm the best and look at all this amp. This is what they do! They're just like, oh, you need, you're doing this on easy difficulty. Clearly we're just going to make all the enemies have a quarter of the health and we're going to give you more ammo than God. We're going to make you think you're playing the division with Joe Wood. Yeah, I... I I don't think I ever strictly said, so I apologize. I played a little bit of The Division, but I didn't really, like, get into it too far. I know you said you predict, like, they kind of predicted stuff, and I imagine you with, like, COVID and bullshit. But, um, it seemed fun, but also seemed kind of grindy. It was weird walking down the street, and, like, you take on one gang of people who would just, like, out of the blue be like, Hey, fuck you, man, hey! And then they would, like, you know, try to like ruin your life or whatever. Also, do you see how much his eyes bulge? Yeah, sorry, I just noticed that. I don't think these guys can actually hurt us. Can these guys actually hurt us? No. But, um. 
it was weird like taking on one gang of people and then like 10 feet later there would be another gang that would just have like 30 million times the health and like to a certain extent i get that like oh you're supposed to be bigger and stronger okay yeah i can work with this why if you're still a human why does one bullet kind of work on you oh yeah like one bullet doesn't seem to work on you like it does to seem to work on other people but like you're not like robots or not aliens with like superpowers or whatever shit like you just kind of get away with it okay. when you reach level 30 ah but i mean it, it looks fun enough oh i will say though i will say though um it felt very much like okay so the game itself was like all fun and good and stuff right the base premise of it felt very much like i don't know if there were someone's conspiracy theories or I'm sh conspiracy theories or like wet dreams about the nature of the government is the only way i could think of describing it and i know that's a weird way to describe it so let me explain the idea that the government deep down secretly has a like a ginormous group of people like a huge group of special agents of course of all ages races nationality or whatever so you can like customize the show your character you know because because of course like why why would why wouldn't you have that um that live just like you normal civilians just doing their lives doing their day jobs but when the call arises and their watch like grows glows yellow and there's like a big circle and they're like Bro, now is the time they go into action in the name of the u.s government to shoot the shit out of everything as as law fucking judge dread there's like uh tom Cl it was based on the tom clancy books which i've never read but i've heard good things about It was like, I just remember that about the premise that there was like some untold number of people who live just like you every day. So, oh shit, I'm about to get sworn. Who live just like you, everyday civilians. But turns out they're like way 50 million times better well trained than the FBI in every way. And also by proxy of them being sent by the government to live in different places they're effectively spies wow combo oh shit they're like they're like basically spies they're like totally spies but um oh shit you are that special agent that's better than every FBI Green Beret Marine good job in the world you're one of them now go to Washington DC where people are fucking things up like it's a Black Lives Matter protest and then you know just kind of nah that's a terrible thing but, and then you know just kind of figure that shit out like fucking I don't know like there's like a disease it's like manufactured definitely not by China or some shit and you just gotta kind of go wiggle your fingers with it we now they're all just retired National Guard soldiers who went above me. See, if that was the pre I remember, I remember hearing about that, where it was just like, yeah, they're like these secret agents and blah, blah, blah. And yeah, if it was just, hey, you're a retired National Guard. You served your eight years. You did your tuition. You went to a trade school. Became a plumber. You have a wife and kids. But you know what? Something bad's happening. And you, as an American want to do the right thing and help people done boom D done who cares you can even have a thing for like you're in the navy and like you could even have like stat alignments or whatever it's like okay so as a navy you generally get access to these groups of stats it would be like an it or like a whatever like a whatever your marine or whatever you know you could like make shit up you could like do a bunch of things but instead it's just like and you're this super secret whatever agent that yo are freaking everywhere who knows how many there are who knows there might be like one there might be like 80 million in america you don't know 
There's a lot of things exploding behind me, and I don't know what they are. Oh shit, that's what they're. Alright, I'm just gonna have to run past. Yeah, I got him! <laughs> oh, wait, what do you mean he wasn't the target? 80 million out of 350. Well, yeah, that was the point. Like, they didn't specify, but they're like, they're everywhere. <laughs> Ready to deploy the case for the US government. I was like, that's creepy as shit. That's horrifying. What do you mean there's this top secret, like, group of whatever people? How do they get enlisted? How do you train them? How have you hid them so far from the public? Are they, whose rule are they under? Are they a tyrannical fist? Are, is this the SS? Have we hit socialism? <laughs> One to five, if not less, is all that scene. Even that's insane! <laughs> and I get it, they wanted, they wanted an excuse that you could, they wanted an excuse so that way you can make any character you want, and that way you can justify whatever role play you have. Yeah. You know, they want, they want you to be able to be any shit, shit, shit. They want you to be able to make any character, and they want you to be able to like make it anything. And they want you to have an excuse to have all the shooter skills, and you could take apart guns upside down blindfolded. And blah blah blah. I I, I get that. I understand. Like you know, like I could take a step back and quit being a shit. And I understand. But also, <laughs> but also, the example that you just said, Jail if that's like the original book, Around that they're just like, hey, they're just retired National Guard guys, uh, guys and girls, just trying to do the right thing. That is so much better. That is so much better in every way. You know what I mean? Trying to like... Trying to like get my inventory emptied. Be careful, there you go. Yeah, yeah. You too. Be like that would have been so much better in just about every Another way. One of these also, okay, we're gonna test if we could do this or if it was solely. Uh, but what if it does? We're gonna test. We're, okay. we're gonna test if this is. So you're telling me, you're telling me that that was a survival mode difficulty thing. Fuck you. Think I'll hit him? Damn it. Fuck you. Fuck, fuck this mode. Fuck that. Uh, oh, Max, haven't we already hit socialism? I don't know. Uh, are people reporting people to the government for not doing things that are generally speaking invasive? That, like, under normal circumstances, you wouldn't accept all in the name of your own well-being and personal, like, personal freedoms and choice? Are things being taken away for arbitrary reasons and licenses and different parts of the government or different parts of, like, cities and things? Like, doing horrible stuff that you would normally never get away with because, as we all know, Paul... Like, power ultimately corrupts. And, you know, you, you don't, generally speaking... Bullshit. 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 Double bullshit. Double bullshit. Yeah, exactly. That should have been put in the guide. Of just like, hey, shit only works on casual. Shit does not work on hard. Uh, if you if you want that party to work hard, uh, the answer is to go fuck yourself. Get coffee and get away with my position. Does anyone remember the first time that I did this last week? And like literally a gar, uh, literally one of those things got within like five feet of me, looked directly at me, and then kept walking. Getting worse. Need some. And now they're like, if you open a door, you're fucked. Okay. 
now it's just this guy. <sighs> sorry, sorry to get dark about politics jokes, but the fun fact is that entire line of jokes that I just made right there. It doesn't matter if you're a Republican or Democrat. You can say and think those same things. So I can offend everyone. But, um... Who you want call it? I liked Metal Gear Solid. <laughs> because, yeah, the idea of, like, AI controlling... Well, you know, AI controlling, like, all sorts of different shit. And, like, calculating all of it and controlling the media. It was fun. Oh, sh I want that. I want that. Turn your ass around. All right, now we're gonna do the next test because frankly, I got what I want, so I don't really care anymore. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can shoot a bunny. Okay, no, I'm gonna see if I can shoot a bunny. Let's see what the game does. Cause I'm all, I'm all pissed and vinegar. Oh. Uh? Oh, we know for a fact they're not, because remember the first revelations? Like, do you, do you remember the first revelations? Where they're like, this is basically Atlantis. And in order to protect Atlantis, we have this satellite dish that is so cool and so inter- I'm gonna shoot that and see what happens. Cool. We have this satellite dish that is so cool and so interesting and it helps to power everything. And oh, by the way, in an emergency, it could be turned into a turbo death laser that could nuclearize the. Oh wait, I, I didn't. I don't even need me. Why'd I do that? No, it can turbo death nuclearize the entire planet. Cause fuck you. And they just did it. They just did it. They just nuked a city. And you're just supposed to sit there and be like, ah, yes, that was a logical choice to make. Like, ah, yeah, good, good job, good job, proud of you. Good. You destroyed Utopia Atlantis. Why is there Utopia Atlantis? And yeah, you never question that shit. You just gotta accept it and keep on going. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> what was I ranting about? I was ranting about politics earlier. To ask whether or not we're in socialism. Oh yeah, don't forget. Uh, oh shoot. Another question of socialism is depending on how much freedom of speech you have and if you're allowed to criticize the government or not. That's another good stapuru. Nice. Shit, they saw me. Well, shit. I okay. I kind of deserve that. That ah, shit. <laughs> yeah, I kind of deserve that. But you know what? I got what I want. Yeah, I even got. I even got okay. that extra. This should cover us. Better head back. I got what I want. I don't care. I had mostly everything I needed. Like that's a shadow Islanders effect that's still there. The but yeah, they're they're probably not considering that or the fact when that they no keep saying up different. Okay, another thing I want to point out about Resident Evil. Another thing I want to point out in the world of like, let's get let's get real political. Let's get real conspiratorial, right? So the BSAA, right, and TerraSave, and Umbrella, right? These are privatized companies that are basically. They ha they're doing the same thing. They're like mercenary groups that just sell to whoever, but in the same process, they kind of just do whatever the fuck they want, and they kind of just ruin places because they can, so they're basically global powers, but not really. I don't think we've ever seen Umbrella sell anything to anyone. But, um... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of like an odd... Yo, know, is there any, like, beholding use of government assets to the people with the BSAA? No, we just kind of we just kind of go hard, play hard. Let's go find out what happened to we just kind of do whatever we want. I guess we just kind of do whatever we want. Yeah, I can double click. I can double tap, but that's that's actually pretty nice. But, um, to what Joe had said. Oh, okay, it's back, guys. I just want to make sure. I, I missed that part. I didn't miss that. Uh, yeah, they don't talk about the news or, like, the common man or... Ah, just... Sorry, as a pharmaceutical company, I can look into the, what the lore is related to pre if you'd like an attempt at TLDR. 
I mean, is that basically what it was? It was like a pharmaceutical bioweapon bullshit, and then they were just like, we're gonna sell shit, and we're going to make money, and then it was like, oh god, we're horrible people, what have we done? And then they were like, alright guys, we have two choices here. We have two choices here. Yo, we accident guys, we invented zombies. Do we A, try to fix our past wrongs, or B, do we lean as hard into it as possible? And as you know, they try to fix our past wrongs and help government and, you know, just, you know, give Neosporin to all the good little children. Nah, just kidding. They lean into it as hard as possible because it's funnier. And they're like, we're going to make zombies, not zombies, we're going to make spy, actually, that statement's still true. We're going to make spiders the size of cars because it's funny. Look at this gambling bullshit. That guy's still alive, by the way. Like, we lit him up. God, they're going down like nothing. I'm gonna go to the challenge. I'm gonna go to this. Actually, this is the final fight. What am I saying? Look at that shit. Now it's like breathtakingly easy. Especially because I have all the ammo. Fuck you, game. Fuck you. Are you dead yet? I bet you still have an instant kill attack, because of course you do. There you go. Oh, nope, nope. I thought you were dead. Yeah, no, they have no redeem factors. Corrupt from start. Had ties in lots of industries and government. Open a farm division shortly after start. Buy weapon development. Violation of lost in 1972 behind closed doors. Yeah, the government was just cool with it. The government was like, we can benefit from having a zombie militia. And then they learned that they could not benefit from having a zombie militia. Let's press on while we can. It kind of went downhill from there. <laughs> now, like, if, if we want to do a deep dive on, like, what can we learn about, like, the political leader. status? Or, like, the laws in regards to, like, different companies in Resident Evil? Shit would be wild. Because there's basically none. Are you telling me each one of these guys now go down in like one bullet? Wow, each one of these guys goes down in one bullet as opposed to the like four or five earlier. Yeah. Yeah. I can't imagine anyone like, okay, let's just talk real world for a second. I cannot imagine anyone in their right mind being approached by a company that's like, dude, dog, here's our plan. Yo, 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 hear me out, hear me out, hear me out, alright? We're gonna invent the world's most powerful weapon. It's gonna make the nuclear warhead look like a fucking firecracker, okay? And they're just like, wow, that's awesome. We could use this to create world peace. And they're like, yeah, sure, totally, world peace. Uh, so here's the deal, here's how it works. Um, zombies. Uh, zombies. But how'd they get the money? Well, I guess be the farmers. <gasps> oh my goodness. The pharmaceutical companies probably manufactured a virus and forced people to take vaccines to make money. Sorry, that's... I don't know why I'm so piss and vinegar about political stuff today, but I am. They had a captive audience. They said they had the cure to the common cold, but you had to take boosters every 10 minutes. So people did, and that's how they made money. Oh, God. Oh, how could I have not seen this coming? Pfizer's umbrella. <laughs> uh, sorry. Okay, I'll stop that. But, um... To cover my ass, I'll say... If you talk to your doctor and you think it's a good idea to get vaccine, go for it. If not, it's not my life. I don't give a shit. That's my opinion on the matter. No, up to freaking you, just as it should be. But, um... Yeah, I can't imagine any real-world official being walked up to and being like, Yo, dude, here, here's here's how this... Uh, I'm, I'll admit, I'm bad at Johnson Johnson versus, like, Pfizer versus, like... If you're, like, Max, what's, like, the specific differences, I will not pretend to know. Is So I don't want to talk on my ass too much. But, um... Which was the company that discovered they were doing, like, incredibly inhumane animal... Ow, asshole. Incredibly inhumane animal research testing kind of a deal. Like, tight, like, basically torturing dogs. 
to see if they can like learn different information. Anyways, um, crap, what was I saying? Yeah, like, just being like, okay, so here's the deal. Like, we're going to create a super weapon. It's going to be more powerful than, like, literally anything in the world. Uh, it's zombies. It's self-perpetuating, unable to be controlled, uh, mutated zombies. And, um, by the way, there's no way to do this without also having gigantic man-eating creatures, which, as they have no natural predator, will grow horribly out of control um, and murder everything. It's like, oh, well, that sounds absolutely horrifying and dreadful, and there'd be, like, no way to, you know, like, people would have a hard time fighting them because it's like, oh, are you going to be able to kill your fellow man? Your your mom just bit out your sister's throat. Are you going to be able to, like, are you, are you going to be able to shoot your mom and so you could save your sister? Oh, your sister got to, you know, there's, like, that big moral implication to it. Like, like that, that would be incredible. Like, demoralizing and blah, blah, blah. How do you control them? Ah, uh, you don't. Straight up, you uh, don't. There is no way to control these zombies. They are all 100% and forever on their own program. And once you just kind of let them go, you just kind of let them go. And they uh, will perpetuate throughout the entire country and eventually uh, the world. Clear. Let's keep going. In fact, the moment you let them out, they fuck over Earth. Alright, that's just how it works. And then some 2-bit country and... Sokovia or whatever is just like take my money and let's fuck over Earth. Like no, no one in their right mind would do that. Everyone would have enough awareness to be. be There's a dude here. Everyone and their uncle would have enough self-awareness to be like that's awful and horrible and fuck you for existing. We are never allowing this shit to pass. But non-Resident Evil because that's the main premise of the games and I can respect that. Where's your leg? There it is. God, you have so much less health. Look how like look how much less health you have. Look how stunned you get. This is still gambling, but it's so much easier. But you said a thing. Uh? They were industrialty. It's more like umbrella. JJ is experienced with powdered milk is better than breast milk for your newborn. Set. Oh God, that's right. I forgot about that, that like, they did a bunch of screwed up sales things like that. And then the whole Dr. Fauci thing with like the AIDS epidemic and how he like, and how that was handled so unbelievably poorly and then even more stuff. That is such, that is such a dumb way to do that projectile, but it's funny. Every time I see it, it makes me laugh. But um... The other thing of like when Dr. Fauci's emails were leaked and it turned out that it was like, yeah, I lied about like half of the stuff because I was trying to keep masks for like different government officials. And everyone was like, wow, fuck you. <laughs> but anyways, you think Stalin or, Hi Stalin or Hitler would have taken that too? But the thing is like, okay, so yeah, I guess, you know, a lot of people with World War II don't really talk about the damage that Russia did to themselves basically like don't get me wrong what hitler did was like absolutely truly awful and horrible and you know there's no yeah this isn't me saying the holocaust wasn't that bad guys you can calm down no no it was awful in every way but it's also important to acknowledge what the heck happened in russia to its own people and um who do you call it um So, yeah, there's a certain amount of I don't give a shit about my own people there. But, like, I can't imagine anyone just being like, yeah, we're just going to, like, we're just going to release a virus. And it's quite literally and irredeemably going to just ruin everything. Like, there's there's no win scenario. There's no, oh, you activate this, you push this button and it ruins this one city. And then the zombies just stop and they listen to you all the time. And then they just fall over dead and light on fire. Isn't that nice? No, they don't. They don't operate that way. They just do whatever the fuck they want. Like you let them off. You let them off. It's just like ah, well, shit. I guess that's Earth's problem now. And Umbrella's just like, yeah, isn't it fun? We're just gonna keep doing it. Where the fuck is the last guy? Don't tell me I glitched this shit. 
Don't tell me I glitched this shit. I don't want to retry it. They're gonna they're gonna judge me based on how much food I have. Where's the last zombie? Where's the last zombie? I would like to be done. Where's the last zombie? Max, there's nine left. Yeah, but... Where's the last zombie? Oh my goodness, green herb. <laughs> Fantastic. Have you, are you guys seeing him? I'm not, I'm not, I'm not seeing him. Anyway. Anyway, sorry, I'll stop talking my ass out about politics. Or talking out of my ass about politics stuff, so. If anyone is like, Max, please stop. I apologize. I'm stopping. Guys are going to be awesome. I think it glitched. Shit. This sucks. Well, hopefully... You're running around too fast. Can't really look. My bad. I'm sorry. You know, when you're, when, you know, when you get in the zone with a shooter, you just kind of get used to, like, just going, you know, going, having to go, like, like, to look around all the time, but, yeah, sorry, that's my bad. The Monsters is actually a pretty nice family TV show. I highly recommend it. I don't have much for television on this island, but thank God that I have TV land. Gal, Gal, I wish fucking Engie over there was. I am somewhat able. I have an inner sense for creatures' weaknesses, so therefore I can see that shit. Twenty bucks says I can still make the shot. Yeah. Okay. It, it, it was going away. It was going away though. No twenty bucks needed. I, I was kind of hoping it would stick a little bit longer. Yeah! Just so I could, like, show off that a little bit, but... Is this glitching again? Okay. Okay, so... He just said a cutscene thing. So that's a good start. Look at the papers! Look! Look! Papers! This building is promising. Hmm? Think there's anything inside? Oh. But we must take care of monsters first. There, yeah, okay, so now. check it out later. Right, so now they're gonna start falling from the sky. Yep. For whatever reason, the cutscene did not trigger. Maybe I, like, killed a few too many and I was, like, real outside their range. The game didn't trigger it or... Yeah, just glitch. Shit happens. Oh, shit. <laughs> this is awful. Yeah, get fucked. Look, I have the ammo to play this game. I did. I did. And yes, I know I have the RPG here, but I'm saving that for the for one of the bigger guys. Or maybe I'll just leave it to prove a point. Did it, did it. That was fun. But Max, that was a waste. You could have lined them both up. Probably and done more damage. Do more damage. Yeah, but it's funny. Still funny. God, look at all this shit. Where am I getting that voice from? That's a very particular voice that I'm. Oh, I know where I'm getting from. Um, there's a streamer called Atstarva, who also does YouTube videos, and whenever he does like um. Whenever, whenever he does a voice of like, but arts, blah, 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 you know, to like, just like to, 
Let's patch ourselves up at least. But to like um to disagree with him or to say like an opposing opinion or whatever. Um that's the voice he uses. And I feel like it's just a good voice in general, so I'm gonna steal it. And if anyone is like, Max, you stole Max, you stole that from Archdarva, I'll be like, yeah. Cause it's a good voice and he's a funny dude. And I highly recommend his videos that I never would have. That guy had places to go. Hold on. No, no. Fuck you, 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 fuck you. Ah, damn it, there's another one. Ah, my hubris. What have I done? Ah, there's no more explosives in the world. How will I ever? Fuck you, fuck you. See, Kroshka, I do that shit too. It's still funny, because I'm an old man. Hold on. You gotta get your little tentacle out of the way so I can shoot you the kidney. Ah, oh, that was breathtakingly easy in comparison. Fuck this. It would have been fun if the mechanics were tighter and they didn't screw me over. There's the end of that thought process. What time is it right now? Almost. Oh. Hey! Oh. Look at this. Look at this blood. I think arena wrote it's it. fucking blood everywhere. Shit's crazy. Oh my goodness. It's Gensky. I think someone words, died here. <laughs> his daughter's last words. I watched him as he faced reality and left. These covers as could you? I don't want to do this to my dad. I can't die here. If he wants to be overprotective, let him. I'd rather put up with that than make him spend the rest of his life wishing he protected me more. As for the old man, he and I came to the end of our road. Well, we saw a body. See, we saw a body on the bed that looked like it. Oh, uh -huh. that looked like it was all <laughs> rotted and stuff. But we've already got to the point where there's revenants. What are you doing? Sorry, the voice acting. Excellent. You could hear the emotion in the old man's voice. Moira. I love that. Ask me my fucking name for once, you dinosaur. You can hear the emotion in that old man's you voice. Should wash mouth out with soap. Moira. So why did he rot so? Ah, he's got the unnamed, you cough up blood disease. Just kidding, it's consumption, it's a romantic disease. A lot of poets died of it, but um. God, that looks so good. That animation and like that, that looks superb. Oh my goodness, I can't believe I'm about to discover a boat. In a place that's still on fire. Anyways. <gasps> Dad? <gasps> I was gonna say they left him with Barry just sitting there! <gasps> that's my girl! I'm proud of my daughter! Uh... He's been coughing since I joined the stream. I thought he was just a chain smoker. No, like, the entire time we knew him, he's been coughing. So, I'm just wondering, because, like, I'm pretty sure the only body we saw was, like, an old rotted one in his room. So, unless he, like, he sat there and then, um, unless he, like, sat there and then was, like, oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go tootle off somewhere else and we just, like, never find his body or whatever. But, um... <laughs> I 
a look on her face. This makes me happy in general. But like that look on her face of like, hey, hey, hey. Maybe there's a sniper rifle I could have gotten, but. Hey. I'm beating a shit. Um. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay, so if I'm gonna get something. Next up, I'm gonna get more. I'm gonna play as Natalia. I know that. So we're gonna cheat a little bit. And we're gonna go heavy on these two. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna make it so I can. I'm gonna make it so I can sense people from the next county. There you go. Game BP when, following, when delivering a follow up with a brick. Ah, I don't give a shit. Um. No, who gives a shit about that? All right, and then otherwise, let's do uh, evade, uh, um, follow up, hold the pick, yeah, and, um, uh, yeah, all right, we're good. All right, now we're going to do the next one. We're going to try survival, and if it's also bullshit and if it's bullshit we'll go to casual because fuck this game for making me feel bad between casual so it's like either you're a child or you're a man there's nothing in between fuck you game where's my gun oh shit it's been You can, you guys, can you guys hear when I do that? Can you guys hear the, make it a little exaggerated? Yeah, fuck you, Silent Hill Bob, get the fuck out of here. You don't represent my dead wife. Fuck you. Just got, just got. Fuck you. Fuck you, Chad! What? You weren't in the hospital with my what? Natalia. Pronounce my name right, you huh? fuck. You look just like me. Oh, but the, the, the ponytail is actually on the same side. Okay, never mind. Oh, but I am you. Now, tell me why you're so upset. First off, personal space. Boundaries, okay? Respect... Lottie. Respect my bubble. She's my friend. Wow, what a coincidence. I have a postcard from Lottie right here. I don't think people, I don't think a little girl would ever talk to someone with that tone of voice. That's a particularly malicious tone you got there, little girl, which is why I have a gun. I have a gun. I can't believe she, Lottie put his own face on his own. Can you imagine sending someone a postcard with your own face? Like, what kind of narcissistic asshole? <laughs> You're gonna be like, I'm gonna post this shit with me. Why did you leave me behind? Don't you love me anymore? What the fuck? I'm all alone now. I'm so sad. I might tear my eyes out. I didn't leave her behind. I would never. Then you'd better tell her. She sounds like a bear on the edge. What does that mean? I'm six! I'm like six! Okay, if Natalia's talking with the enemy, you'll fail the mission. Great. Further, Natalia cannot sense enemies here. Great. Dr. Ty, however, can move about freely without being seen by enemies. She can also sense location of enemies. Guide Natalia to Lottie's postcards to progress to the next stage. Great! See, so you're not real. Great. A monster. What do we do? Great. It'll kill you if it sees you. Shut the fuck up. It won't see me. I'll be careful. It saw me. Fuck. Natalia learns to swear. Shit, damn. Ass. So I should explain that joke. So um. So my sister, my my older sister, older by two years, 
is how would I describe her? She's a good Christian girl. She doesn't swear. So, Watch but it. there's another one up ahead. Fuck you. Where? I don't see anything. Are you telling me the entire time? I don't see them. Want me to show you where? Are you telling me the entire time that she's been sensing things and helping Barry? Dark Natalia's been like, me, me. But she, like, never talked to someone else. But it's too dangerous. Point. Look. I'm not afraid. Ooh. They can't hurt me. Ooh, nice. Point. Look. Look. Ah, but she can only put the little radar dish on one of them at a time. Hello. Look. <laughs> Monster. Look. See? It's right here. Oh my goodness, what are you blind? It's right here. Look, 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 look. Okay, sorry. So I can only... So I can see all the monsters. Look. Look. Mm. Shit's tricky. Oh, but I can't point. Okay, so... Well, hang on. I, I can do whatever I want. So, it's just like... Okay, so... I guess we got these two assholes. Wow. I guess we got these two assholes. And then we just got to get up. Ah, okay. Okay. Come with me. I'll be there when I'm ready. Oh, I hated that. I'll, I'll be there when I'm. I'll be there when I damn well please. I like this creepy music though, not gonna lie. I don't like that this is basically gonna be a game of if I'm found I'm dead though. Once again it goes back to my whole I don't like it. I love that she just walks around. She's just like, watch me give a shit. Am I right, dog? Look. 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 <laughs> Just vomits a little bit. He's trying like, bleh. Look. <laughs> Do you see it? Do you see it? Do you see it? It's there. It's there, Natalia. Hot sh uh, shit. Shit dang. Yo, dog. Oh, yeah, sorry. So the bit is, is that like, so my sister doesn't swear. There's been a few times she has, but it's been very rare and usually in a very serious moment. Or when she wanted to distinctly say that someone was a bitch. Um, but how is that possible? So, I started doing... You need to worry about Lottie. She's all you have left, right? Alright, um, I'm gonna mark that one. Who gives a shit how I'm here? Or what my powers mean or whatever. I don't know. Fuck, man. The world's a crazy place. You got bigger things to worry about. <laughs> she, she just runs by. Oh, it's funny. You got bigger things to worry about, maybe. I don't know. Fuck. Yeah, so the running gag with my sister is that... And I'll be when I basically say something to the effect of like, yeah. So I was looking at this, and she's like, and she looked at me, and she's like, ah, fuck shit. Ah, damn it. Yeah, don't so don't show her dying. Don't don't yeah. Say don't don't show her dying. Like, come on, it's a child. So yeah, if you ever hear me go, ah, shit, fuck. Really that that's that's what I'm referencing. Possible. Who cares? You need to worry about Who cares? Your inner self is a dick. 
The inner part of your brain fucking sucks. So, okay, so I already died. So how close can I, can I like run? Can I sprint? E. What was the E? Oh, the E was getting up. So I can run. I can like run right up to him. Let's see, I think you're allowed to kill kids in games due to the law. That's why in Skyrim they are invincible. There's probably some like child abuse, whatever. You know, something reasonable. Alright, okay, I'll get yeah, Frank. Get get your ass. Right where I can see you. Look. I will be. Wow. You're already bullying her. What a piece of shit. Okay, so we got that one. Let me say, look. Okay, so how am I gonna do this? All right, seems pretty. Okay. Seems simple enough. Especially with my new <laughs> <laughs> Just seeing her seeing her sprint by I don't know if it reminds me of um I think it reminds me of kind of Lydia and Elizabeth. Like Lydia from Skyrim and Elizabeth from Bioshock. How like every now and then they just kinda like get stuck in the wrong spots. They just like sprint as fast and hard as possible to like where they need to be. And that, that's what that reminds me of. That she's, that she's just like, what? <laughs> oh, shit. And I find that very funny. All right, is there anyone else? Nope. Give me a checky point, please. Do you remember hmm? what happened on this island? Do you no, remember? Just that it was something bad. Do you? I don't know how the rest of that song goes. Do you remember? Okay, shit. So we got. Look, look. Okay, so we got that one. And we got the other one, which they both appear to be moving in. Back and forth. Nice, simple, you know, basic stealth shit. Can I crawl through that? Yeah, you know, basic stealth shit, right? This isn't where I want to be. This sucks. Yeah, you're dumb. It does suck. Okay, so we just got like one out here. Look, look, look. We got like one way the fuck. Uh, there's a glowing thing in there. Oh shit, it's the postcard. I was gonna say like, what the heck is this? <laughs> what the what the fuck's going on around here? Okay, so then we got you. This is interesting, though, that they're, like, fully letting me scout out the area. I'm um, sorry, little brain entity. Are you getting sleepy? But I feel like I'm in a little bit of a shitty situation right now. Bullshit, you didn't see me. Bullshit, you didn't see me. Fuck you. Once again, Max, why are you being so pissed at vinegar? I don't know. I just am. If I had to, like, make up a legitimate reason, it probably has something to do with, like, me working out right before the stream. And I haven't worked out in a little bit. So it felt good getting back into it. So maybe it's, um, maybe I have a shot of energy from that. You know what I mean? I don't know if I'm going to make that on time. Actually, he moves pretty far, so... Okay, so now, yeah, so you'll run around there. Look, 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 look. Damn it, look. 
No, actually, like, you. You. You asshole. There. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna have to, like... We're gonna have to... Get around to there without you noticing me. And we're gonna have to hopefully time it in such a way... So that... Why do I even have health if everything's an instant kill? <gasps> Shit! Ha! The fuck you say to me to tell you? <laughs> Piece of shit. As an adult, I am legally okay with the idea of drop kicking you, kid. So I'd just like you to count your lucky stars. Keep that in mind. Especially uh, you. You, you dick. Fuck you. How old am I again? Am I 12? 6? Yeah, whatever. Yeah, now that I generally know where everyone is. I mean, in some ways, okay, so in some ways I'm kind of complaining because it's like, wow, so there's literally nothing I can do if I'm found, I'm found, right? But they're not lying to me. They're not, like, giving me false hope and they're not like, oh, this thing might be able to do something. You, you might be able to blah, blah, blah. It's like, no, straight up, there's not, there's not shit to do, okay? Your only mechanic is to never be found. That's it. It's, you know, it, it, it's nice and clean. I, you got you got a nice way. You can look around. You can see things. You can go, Palik. but you can also, you know, she can't interact with anything. So it's a game of, it's essentially an escort mission. You know, it's, a, it's effectively an escort mission in that way, but because it's so simple, I can't get mad at it. You know, like, hey, what's your goal? Get point A, point B. Are there any items? Nope. Are there any weapons? Nope. Anything you need to be aware of? Uh, not really. No. You got one girl that can see and one girl that can interact with the world. How good's their vision? Not very good. It's not very good, but oh shit! Wait, wait, wait! No, we're good. We're good. No, it's not. It's not very good, but it's a uh, shit. Uh, where? Okay, good. Is that a letter? You know it. It's from Lottie. Let's see if we can get to it. Why the fuck are there letters? Hi. Where are you? Hi. Let's see. Nice, simple. I can get behind this. You know, I can, I can get behind this somewhat. Dear Natalia, I'm on the other side of the island. Dear Natalia, <laughs> I'm trapped in a tunnel underneath the village. How did I get out of the suit? I'm probably dying. Why do you hate me? Uh-oh. That doesn't sound good. Maybe you should just let her go. No, wait. She's always been there for me. I won't abandon her. Uh, Lottie sounds kind of backbiting. And there was somebody with me. Forget about the past. Just focus on what's ahead. Lottie sounds kind of backbiting. Okay, yeah, okay, so good, good, good. So she's staying there. Um, I would start running around with Natalia, but I legitimately don't know where I'm trying to go. Hi. Kinda got that mouth in the stomach thing going. You know, apparently, apparently the whole mouth in the stomach thing that I'm circling right there, apparently that's like a hardcore fear set into society in many different ways. Kinda like how dragons and other certain creatures, dragons and yetis and various waterborne whatevers are also like a consistent fear throughout different cultures even though they weren't originally shared with each other. Right? Mouths in stomachs. Something that's open, that can open up big enough to consume someone whole. Apparently, it's common. Isn't that neat? Can I go in here? No. 
Okay, where's the end goal? Holy shit. We get bottles. We got ourselves a bottle. Okay, where's... Where's the freaking... Where's the freaking letter? Where's the freaking letter? Can I not see it? Is it invisible to me? Okay, okay, okay. Got it, got it, got it. Alright, so... Look! So... Alright. Let's test this fence. If I get caught, I caught him. I, if I get caught, I'm caught. I'm fine with it. I want to see if this fence, which obviously has holes in it, does not count as cover. Does not count as cover. That's fine. I'm okay with that. Like, I'm totally fine with that because now we know. Because some games will make it so it's like, look, it's a nice graded fence that you can see through. Isn't it lovely? But it, like, counts... And it like counts as full cover and you can't shoot yeah, through it or anything that. like that. But that. now we learned. We just learned. That I just put myself in a really bad situation. Okay, good. Look. Look. I really wish you increased the range on the look. Yeah, now that we know, we can work with it. You know what I mean? Look, 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 look. As long as you don't get Miss Twitchy with me and arbitrarily decide that you can like do shit. Hey, look. What's it for? Look. You can use it to hide from the monsters. Look. Uh. It's not even phased. He was just like, huh, must, must just be a low hanging cloud. Eh, guess that's my day today. Okay. That's the end of that thing's stop process. Alright, yeah, so you hide there. Okay, door that I clearly need to open. Door that I clearly need to open. Door that I clearly need to open. Door that I need to clearly open. Lottie was always the one who knew what to do. Lottie was possessed by so Satan. You have me now. You can trust me. I'm not an asshole. Just kidding. I'm totally an asshole. Yeah, okay, well, I can't open this one. There's no zombies behind this door, so yeah, that's... that's... Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Ah, sh oh, this is fine. Look. All right, so we got that going for us, which is good. We got a smoke screen. We're probably gonna have to run through those two. Let's let's just be honest with ourselves. I I think that's yeah. You know, they're setting up that like, hey, this dude, this door's a trap. But this door. Oh yeah, there's no getting around that shit. Okay, so we throw a smoke bomb here, right? And then we go, ah shit, my dude, and we run through here. Easy peasy, right? Smash cut to someone. Smash cut to someone doing this DLC and doing a no smoke screen battle run. Some insane somehow they're able to do it. Shit. Okay, so we got those two. Actually, I was gonna say, like, I think I just got caught. Shit. I thought that was gonna be enough. I was wrong. What a shame. She's not even worried! You're not even worried about me! Fuck you! <laughs> Fuck you, Dr. Talia! Well, fuck. 
Oh, I gotta do this again. Damn it. Uh, the rule's supposed to be that if there's a flipping door that loads into a new area, you autosave. How dare you? How dare you? I will say, though, once you know the path, like... Boom. What was that, 20 seconds? Not even? There's only the two, right? That's just me, my friend, my th it's attached to my shoulder, my other friend who has a friend. Oh, he doesn't have a friend attached to his. Actually, my friend's attached to my jaw. That's me, my friend, this car that kind of looks like it has a Satan smiley face on it. We like walking around in circles. I think it's fun. Yeah. Sometimes we go we go tailgating on the weekends, but today we got patrol. We got patrol this spot for some it's unknown reason. Long. Fuck if I know. So scary. All right, we'll keep looking. Oh my goodness! You're stronger than that now. Oh shit. Cause a lot of dudes down there. Okay, so th obviously there's a certain amount of I could probably. Hmm. Problem is I don't know what my end goal is. You know what I mean? Like I can do things, but if I don't know where I'm trying to go, hmm. that's unfortunate. Sorry to hear that. Here we go. Smoke bottle. I'm guessing you need the smoke bottle because we have to go through this doorway. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, that makes sense. So, they're treating smoke bottles in this game like keys. I see. Also, so does that game, like, have the same level of difficulty regardless of how many people are playing then? Or just no one wants to do it? Jeez. I'm sorry. It's been a long-ass time, though. Been a while. Okay, so oh shit. Let me look at that. So are you like able to do it on your own or is this you'd rather like not kind of a deal? Well shit. <laughs> well that looks like yours. Dark Italia runs up there like, wow, sex is suck. <laughs> Maybe you should have thrown me downstairs so I could have looked around first. And I was like, eh, yeah, yeah. Came along. yeah, fair enough. That you got so me. Scary. All right, we'll keep looking. But I don't think you need her. You're stronger than that now. You're a vampire. Right now, no, I, 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 I understand. I understand why that'd be important. Oh, we have to. We're gonna have to go over there. Eh. That's why this is a pickle. I appreciate, though, that, like... Wait, okay, hold on, hold on. Go, 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 go. There's nothing to... Oh... Okay, that kind of is something to hide. Hide behind. Especially if you keep going in a nice little circle, mister. Because may maybe I need maybe I just need to be farther away. Maybe I need to hug the other wall and like then I can grab the bottle and throw it and then I can move through the door quick. Until and Lottie came along. Okay. That was so scary. All right, we'll mm. keep looking, but I don't think you need her. You're stronger than that now. I think I have the right idea though. I feel like this is a game mode where like you could really speed run this shit if you want to. You know what I mean? Like once you knew, once you knew everyone's path, kind of a deal. I bet you could speed run the shit out of this. Like, smash cuts of some video being like the whole DLC cutscenes included five minutes. 
Yeah, okay. So this time what I'm going to do is the same thing. But I'm just going to hug the wall. There we go. You know where I am. <gasps> oh, dang. So I have to, I have to grab a throat. Cut idea. I, I got, I got. All right. Uh. Until Lottie came along. But that's not hundred percent guaranteed. They just walk up. All right. Jeez. I mean, I guess, it, I guess that makes sense, especially if there's like big tanky enemies. But like the basic enemies. You know, they they wouldn't want you like to mod a gun, so it's like all accuracy and all like ammo capacity whatever you just like shoot the head 50 million times to like stun lock them while your friends actually do real damage i can understand that but like i kind of sucks that they just like run up on you regardless you know what i mean okay so yeah we're gonna have to Yeah, this this is a little tricky because we don't we don't tr oh, I just know that handprint. We don't truly know the range of that guy's sight. That's the problem. <gasps> wow. Less than you have less than a second. What a shame. All right, already I'm going to say this. Already I'm going to say this. Um if I'm if I may, if I was part of the team Until that makes the little off. miss the little Miss DLC, so I would All make right. it so that you okay. have about but three seconds or however. Actually, no, no, no. Now. I wouldn't make it three seconds. I would say it moves towards you quickly. So if for like, however you figure out a way to like evade. So like maybe you just like kind of take a turn and then it has to like figure out how to get to you, which I get would be hard to program pathfinding, but it already has pathfinding for kind of that. So really just reuse that. And then, um, and then from there, have a... So that way, if, like, someone sees you, you can go, like, Spook Bomb! And then you can just, like, leave. I would add that. The other thing I would add is maybe have it so Dark Natalia can, um... Yeah, maybe make it so Dark Natalia, when she targets someone, or maybe just make it so only she can see it. Make it so only she can see it. Make it so she can see the length of their vision. You know what I mean? Like, g give me something so I know how far away or what their whatever is. So that way I'm not playing that game where I'm like, I guess I only have like a second to work with them. Yeah, I'm not really sure. Look. Because if I'm going to have to redo that 15 times, I'm going to get annoyed. Not going to lie. There's nothing freaking back here. Why am I back here if there's nothing freaking back here? Let's see. Uh... I would have put this on the shelf and came back later. I admire your persistence. I mean, see, I thought I was going to, I was thinking like, am I going to finish the DLC in like two hours? And then I don't know what I'm going to do with myself for the rest of the stream. So I was a little concerned, but, um, okay. I drink, I drink my water, but, um, if we're able to do this fast enough, I mean, call it a stream then, right? I almost inhaled that. And then we can do, um, we can do, uh, who's one call it? We can do Resident Evil 7, which I'm really excited for. On, um... Friday. We can do it on Friday. Actually, wait, no, no, no. We're not going to be able to do it on Friday. Okay, um, yeah, unfortunately, I don't... Well, maybe. Put, put Friday down as a maybe. I'm not sure. There might be something... There might be a family matter that takes my attention. There might not be. Yeah, I, I know it sucks, but um, that's just the unfortunate situation. Oh, green. E. 
A for cranberries. No. Um. Okay, what the fuck am I supposed to do? There's no lever to pull. There's no... This is where the path led me. They... Where am I supposed to go? Where am I supposed to go? This is where they went? This is... No, I did not. Am I going to feel like a horrible person if you send that to me? <laughs> I imagine this is more of those, like, wow, that fits. You know, like, play the role kind of situation. That's also when she won an award, though. I am really, I, I am, like, really genuinely excited about 7. 7, 8, and, um, the remakes. Because, I think I mentioned this before, but you may not have been here, Redress. All the games you guys keep telling me about, it was always, like, everyone was really excited for me to play 4. Yeah, obviously when I was playing the first, okay, I can start getting text, so that's fine. But um, yeah, obviously when I started, everyone's like, "Oh, one is awesome, two is awesome, three is awesome. You're gonna love the remake of one, and oh, two and three are amazing." Ba 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 ba. But um, everyone always brought up like, "You're gonna love four. Like four is an absolute gem." Like, ah, oh, five and six, I don't like them, but you might have fun, you know, like that kind of thing. What am I supposed to do here? I don't get it. Like, like, this is me, like, I'll take a hint, like, because, yeah, that's the, because shouldn't it now just be walk through there? Like, just walk through, now you made your whole way around. I didn't get an extra smoke, whatever. Like, sh shit. Like, was there supposed to be a smoke grenade here? Like, what the fuck? And I can't crawl through here, so what the fuck am I supposed to do? For days. Yeah, everyone was, like, so excited about that stuff, and I was getting really excited, too, but 7 and 8, and, and like, the new ones, everyone's like, you're going to love them. Okay, a lot of people apparently didn't like the Resident Evil 3 remake. Apparently, they like, cut out a bunch of shit. I don't know. We'll, we'll judge them when we get there. But, um, you know, everyone's, like, super excited for me to do 7 and 8. So, I'm really excited. I think it's going to be fun. And also, because it's a first-person shooter, I feel like I'm going to do a lot better with, um, difficulty and whatnot. Like, I think I'll be able to, like, ramp up the difficulty. <laughs> it was almost too <laughs> Felt very 80s. All right, um, I'm going to make up a guide because... This is weird. Uh, Resident Evil 2 Revelations Little Miss Guy. See, like 30 minutes. I imagine if you do it perfect, it's 30 minutes. Okay, so... Uh... Okay, before opening it, enter the find no swap file in the room. Blah, 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 blah. I bind the crates and wait for the wrench moving to slip behind in between the crates and pull on the right to use the to the right of the pole behind the car is a smoke screen bottle. Use it to proceed to the next area, or you can go around the fence, saving the smoke screen bottle. In the tunnel, run to the end of it to find a letter from Lottie. So you're not gonna tell me how to do it normally? You're not gonna tell me how to do it normally? Wow, that's it. Wow, that's the end. This guy, okay, this guy's like, it's all right, but it's not telling me how to do it normally, so what the fuck? Okay, town area. Uh, open the blue door to the right, then have to tell on the hole. Make sure the circle is not facing them until you fall immediately hide behind the nearby bed on the lower floor to avoid being seen by the remnants of sir. The circle's room. There's another one that stands by the door, and you don't want to go near the door with the remnants. So wait for the circle to turn back to you and fall around the corner toward the other door. Grab the smoke bottle on the shelf to the left of the living room, up the stairs, then down the hall on the top floor. You'll. Oh. Move up the stairs, then down the hall on the top floor. You'll enter the hall with the remnant from before, but it'll be facing away from it. I'll open the door to continue. It's not. But there's no way to get through. Am I going to let myself. Did I waste this? No. 
I'm inside! Looks like yours. Anyways. <sighs> okay, well, I guess I'm... I guess the reason they're pooping me here... I was so scared. All right, we'll keep looking. But I don't think you need her. Hang on. You're stronger than that now. If there's a smoke ball here, I'm just gonna take that shit and go. You know what I mean? Yeah, we're just gonna we're gonna follow these two. They're moving in an insanely predictable pattern, so We'll just kind of like search around, see if we can find a smoke bottle. Shove a zombie, and the zombie's like, I twitch enough that I don't know when people touch me. I say that as a joke, but that's probably a real thing. Like, they probably honestly do twitch. Not gonna lie, she scared me for a second. Um, she probably, they probably do twitch enough that like, if you shut, like, if you just lightly brushed up against one, they'd be like, okay, so did something actually just touch me or are my legs just going all wiggy again? Cause my legs go wiggy all the time. Like, I don't know if I can describe to you just how wiggy my legs are on a regular basis. They are so unbelievably wiggy. Why the fuck? Is this a casual versus survivor? This is a casual versus survivor thing again, isn't it? Some bitch. This is a casual versus survivor thing. Fuck. Fuck my life. Alright, okay, cool. So, less smoke bottles. Yeah, that's how they raise the difficulty of it. It's not increase or decrease the amount that they can see you, or forgiveness, or why even have a fucking difficulty setting. No, no, it's solely because... It's solely they take away the number of smoke bottles. Lovely. Okay. So. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. You go down. And you're gonna look around for a second. And you're gonna see if there's another smoke bottle. If there isn't. Alright, cool. Alright, so we got this we got this one. That we're probably gonna need. And then we have to see if there is. Oh, that's where I was supposed to go. I went up and I wasn't supposed to. Oh, so that means I never even need the smoke bottle, possibly. It's a risk to get it. I see. I see. Okay. Uh... Eventually cause that damage for loss since yeah, but that's assuming there's no regenerative mutation effects, which you know which, which you know what happens. I mean, we've never seen them grow back their skin. They like they stay as like their weird wiry corpses, you know what I mean? So like unless like okay, so the whole point of Ouroboros is it's every time. The whole point of Ouroboros is like it takes corpses and like kinda like stitches it together, right? But it can kind of operate on its own, but not really. So So there might be, to a certain extent, like, um, thank you, God. There might be, to a certain extent, uh, like, if there isn't enough flesh material for it to use, and there might be a certain level of, like, you can't just throw ground beef. You have to, like, actually give me a corpse of some kind to operate with. Thank goodness, I think that was an honest hit. You know, maybe, maybe it'll be like that, and it's like, oh, you know, uh, because our cells are dying, okay, our taste is going out the window, our smell is going out the window, okay, but what, what senses can we keep? Sight, we can keep sight and hearing. You know, that's not as volatile, and the body's like, great. You know, we can work with sight, We're like, fantastic, let's work with sight. Ooh, you turn around fat. You weren't even looking at me! Fuck you! You weren't even looking at me! What a shame. I still can't get over that she makes fun of you. You can hear it in her voice of, What a shame! It's like... 
You're in my head. If I die, you die. Fuck you. <laughs> Yeah, definitely already with this mode, I would add. Just me thinking out loud, I would add. If they see you, you have a second or so to throw a smoke bottle or to immediately duck into cover. And then, you know, they have to figure out if they could see you or not. Even if it's like a, all right, you know, 90% chance they're still going to find you. It would at least give you something. You know what I mean? But, um, you know, I'm, I'm a big fan I'm a big fan of difficulty, but giving room to succeed. Alright, we're probably going to have to go this way. Unless there's a reason to. Yeah, this guy is not moving. This guy is also not moving. Is this the door? No. So. Asshole. Alright. So we gotta figure out where that letter is. I'm getting the impression that Dark Natalia can't see the letter. Oh, shit, there it is. There's the goal if I ever saw one. So this might just be a general stay on the fringes of their vision. Sneak around. But uh, our maximum drop for lurk mode again. Gotta do a few chores, but maybe chime before stream end. If I finish up fast enough, I hope to struggle though. It isn't too bad, dude. Oh, well, it's all good. Thanks so much for being willing to lurk, though. I hope me complaining and stuff is, will be somewhat entertaining. But yeah, I I should. Ah, uh, God, that's, that requires me to figure out a night bot. I don't know what I would do with a lurk. It with like the exclamation point lurk thing though. Besides just being like, thanks for lurking. Love you, smooches. And everyone would be like, that's weird. And I'd be like, yeah. It is so hard to tell when he's turning and when he isn't. Like, I'm more going... I'm not going by his head. I'm going by his shoulders. Let's see. Oh. Uh Another big fuck you wave heading away. It did seem to be that kind of a game when I played it. But I didn't get very far. But, um, yeah, it did seem kind of like, uh, and now we're just going to throw everything at you. Oh, and you're here. Oh, shoot. Okay. Let's see what we got. So we got you circling. You're not moving. That's the exit. We're going to need to use a smoke bottle. Let's pretend we don't have a smoke bottle. Is there another smoke bottle? Um. Ah, I see. I see. So you're gonna have to do this. <gasps> there is another smoke bottle. Damn it. Yeah, that'll just be a matter of getting to that slam it and run kind of a deal. Because the alternative is... Yeah, what happens if I just stand here? The alternative is getting to here and going back. And that sure as shit ain't gonna happen. Nope, so we're not seeing anything too weird, so... Once that guy starts the loop, we'll... <gasps> or... I can move here, climb up, I can climb up and then throw it, it down, run and grab that smoke, and then leave. So that way I don't have to, like, creep around and risk them seeing me for a bullshit reason. Yeah, look at me. I'm Captain Clever. Gotta be fast about it, though. Gotta be fast. Well... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it makes sense. I was whoa, 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 whoa. It makes sense. I was jumping, but and I got real close. But I was hoping I'd have dainty little girl feet that I could just be like, oh, oh, oh. just kind of keep the party moving. 
But hey, now that I know that, here's, an, here's another question. What if I just do this? Grab that shit. It's like, hey, God, I plan to like use the one anyway, right? Yeah. <laughs> what if, what if, what if I just, what if I just launch it? What happens hypothetically if I just send it? No. This is a tight loop if I ever saw one. There's no extra smoke bottles, too, so it's just tight. Yep, it's it's just tight. So we're going to... Yep, this is fine. This is okay. Oh, no. See, they're off rhythm a little bit. Actually, yeah, they're off rhythm a little bit. I thought they were, like, perfectly whatever, but they're not. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah. Oh, this is perfect. Auto save, please. I don't. I don't think we're gonna get another moment that works. That that worked that perfectly. So. Okay. So let's. All right. So. No getting around that shit. You could just. Well, I guess they didn't want to change the map to stay consistent, which is an interesting balance of like how they're how they have to like. Find ways to block us off without changing the map. You know what I mean. Alright, so I'm just gonna open this. Auto save, auto save, auto save, auto save. Yes! Yes, thank you, God. Alright, so we got you. We got you. We want that. So we're gonna have to get that and then find a place to hide. Probably like here, maybe, or. Somewhere we're gonna we're definitely gonna die a few times trying to get that and that's okay And then we just have to get to this door which will require a smoke bomb. That's okay Yep, it's okay Yep, that's just a tight window. That is just a very tight little window. But it's okay. You know, the one guy is stuck there, so we're going to have to use a smoke bomb. That's okay. That's perfectly fine. Okay. Now, I don't know where his line of vision is, so I'm just going to send it. Damn it. I think I had the right idea, though. I think I had the right idea what a shame. of, um, yeah, I think I had the right idea of, like, just the moment you can't just throw that shit. And I found the fuck, it told me with a no respawn error message. Oh, no. Yeah, he, he is, his little, um, that guy is, like, path. It's a little more that way than I think it is. It's a little less that way than I think it is. So, I gotta be, like... Johnny on the spot. Which apparently is not a phrase everyone's used to. It's right up there with when I say hot to trot. Apparently that's also another phrase that people are not entirely used to. For a second, I thought I saw the glow of another bottle. I got really excited. 
for a split second. I thought I saw it. Okay, so I'm just going to stand right here. Or I'm just going to sit right here. Move fast. I just gotta move fast. <sighs> Thank you, God. What if Lottie's the whole reason you're alone? What if no one wants to be around you because you're a stupid girl who loves stupid teddy bears? What the fuck? I know she's just a teddy bear, but I've had her for so long. I just why are you such a dick? My life that's good. Oh my goodness! You see comfort in things. What are you a child? Fuck you. Alright, so this thing's actually looking towards there, so that so the only thing that guy's doing is just stopping us from using that right side, which whatever, honestly. Ah shit, that's where the door is. Okay, never mind. So we have to go this way, and then we're gonna have to sneak behind like this and then go in. Okay, deal, deal. So this shouldn't be that bad. Okay, so you're just facing towards us. So we just gotta wait till you're not facing towards us, like so. Now, getting to the next part, I think it's gonna be as tricky. Look how short that loop is. Oh, shoot. Good thing you'd see me. Ah. I gotcha. Oh, see if you can like snipe people before like auto saves in. I gotcha. That's nice, Moira. I've never seen you again. What if Lottie's the whole reason you're alone? What if no one wants to be around you because you're a stupid girl who loves stupid teddy bears? I know she's just a teddy bear, but I've had her for so long, I just... She's the only thing left in my life that's good. Damn it. I almost had that. I feel like I did have that, actually. Maybe, maybe I need to hug the... I should have hugged the fence a little bit more. I was probably like just out enough that she saw like the tip of my head and was like, you bitch. And I'm like, oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm sorry. What if Lottie's the whole reason you're alone? What if no one wants to be around you because you're a stupid girl who loves stupid teddy bears? I know she's just a teddy bear, but I've had her for so long. I just, she's the okay. only thing left in my life that's good. My new imaginary friend certainly ain't good. My new imaginary friend's a dick. Well, she does give me the power to sense zombies. It's pretty useful. Except when it's not. Like, right now. Yeah, so... This guy's actually pretty... This guy's actually pretty eagle-eyed, so... We just gotta be fast. Okay, so... The hard part here is going to be... Okay, let's just watch where he goes. Yeah, because that guy's not moving. Okay, so that guy's not even really... It's more making sure he's not looking at us. <gasps> Shit, that's hard. Mm, that's rough. Mm, that's rough. Mm. That's a lot of people's fields of vision we have to get through right there. What if Lottie's the whole reason you're alone? What if no one wants I'm gonna to try my best not to use a smoke bottle, but the smoke bottle is totally the answer. I know she's just a teddy bear. Yeah, the smoke bottle is totally the answer. She's the only thing left in my life that's good. If I use the smoke bottle, I'd just be able to lickety split that shit. Alright. <gasps> oh shit! I keep thinking that cover's low enough, but it isn't. There might be a way. Okay, Dolls Donuts. 
if there if there's a grading system, I'm willing to bet like being caught is removed and it's replaced with how many bottles did you use and like the less the better kind of a deal. And then it would be like you know, for an S ranking, you're only allowed to use like three or you know, all the situations where there's like basically no way to get around it. But I've had her for so long. Yep, I'm using it. She's the only thing left in my life that's good. Yeah, so. Yeah, so now that we realize that situation, it's going to be a matter of figuring out the best time and place to throw a smoke bomb and then just run into the smoke like a madman. Damn it. Okay, that got me. That's fair. That got me. Hey, they're going to give me the most. They're going to give me a very. D rating. It would be an F rating. I'm like, you died 47 times in this game that is an instant death mode. How dare you? You're bad at this game. Uninstall. Got the hungry birds. But I think. I don't think there's much left. I think I think we can do this. Yeah, it's pretty ipsy right there. That's much less less ipsy. Yep, it's perfectly okay. Huh. <sighs> gonna say now i just have to pray that like i covered his vision because like if the circle of the smoke wasn't covering the door so for whatever he reason he could turn his head and look at the door that would have been death so whew, thank you god it's not dark to me so stupid a little darkness can't stop you you know natalia what you need is a real friend an abusive friend Oh. Or was I just sleeping? You're probably sleeping. Do you notice that I'm wearing a necklace and you aren't, signifying that I'm more mature? Or some shit? I don't know. Fuck. Hey, come on. Come with me. Right. Come with me. Right. Okay, I'm coming with you. Shit. Fuck. Damn. Look. Another letter from Lonnie. It's freaking huge! <laughs> Alright. So we probably just got one more. Honestly. Yeah, this isn't that bad. There's a few spots that are a little rough. I'm near the ocean now. I can't focus the camera! I saw lots of dead bodies. It was awful. Maybe I'll drown myself. You should forget about me. Find a new friend. This ain't me, if you live. See the Islanders' corpses. Someone experimented on them. <laughs> I think I remember. Ooh, so someone. You just give up. No, I won't. Oopsie poopsie. Someone must have experimented on them. Blah, blah. I wonder who did that. Pfft. Sorry. All right, so yeah, let's just let's hang out here. I really appreciate that she auto crouches, um, and that she auto stays there. Okay, so we got your ass. Oh god, that mouth thing is disgusting. Um, we got your ass. Who you're just holding position. You just you're just flat out holding position. Um, there's no loot that I need to be aware of in the grass. In fact, this area is in, is a dead end. So, I think the best course of action would be, yeah, we have to watch exactly where you go. Oh, I'm going to have to be right here, possibly, or smoke bomb it, and then I can go here, go here. Ah, but he's looking at me. Damn it. I might be able to skimp that. Okay, um. 
Okay. Damn it. Count your blessings, name them one by one. Count your blessings, see what God has done. Count your blessings, name them one huh? by one. Oh? Jeez, that sucks. Right. You can't see it. You need my eyes. You need me. So how come the how come the warping's happening to how come the warping's happening to me though? If I'm nothing more than I really hope I don't have to carry that. Cause that's gonna suck ass. Yeah, why is it affecting me? I'm not real. Unless I am real. Shit. Alright. So that's the challenge. That's the challenge. Assholes. Okay. So. Kind of want to bite the bullet just to see how carrying, how carrying it works. You know what I mean? Okay. Where are you going? Where are you going? Auto save. That was two very lucky breaks. Please auto save. Please, 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 please auto save. You've been real damn generous with these auto saves. Please continue to do. Thank you, God. All right. You must be ready to snap by now. What is your deal? I'm fine. I won't stop until I find Monty. There are lots of monsters this way. Maybe you can hide in the grass. Look who's shitting in the tall grass. Alright, so we got you, which is fine. We got you. You don't seem particularly... Ah, shit. Okay, okay, okay. So we see this here. Let's see if we can figure out where it needs to go. Alright, so... We have to carry it through here. Okay, it has to get over there. Oh! Okay. I just really just struck me how much taller he is than I am. I hate it, Talia! <laughs> I am such a small, small little girl. And he is so tall that I can't hide behind this bush. 
He is so cool. Can I hide in this bush? They said hide in the grass. This isn't grass. Like, I thought for a second, I thought for a second that he was going to, like, push me out of cover on accident, look down, and be like, oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, Chad. Hey, Chad, what's up? <laughs> oh, my goodness. I got so lucky there. So this is going to be a game of trying to move it while in the grass, I think. Okay, so we really are just learning that these, this grass is just safe. Just safe, period. Rattle, 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 rattle. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Come again. I can't believe he straight up shoved me. This was just pushing me with his leg, and he's like, ah, these legs always kind of had dead whatever, dead little. Ah, he slaps my, he slaps his leg a few times. Like, ah, you yeah, know, sometimes when it gets cold, they act up. Like, it's fine. No biggie. I'm sitting there just like. <laughs> the looking now. Give me control. I don't want your help. I can't find her myself. Give me control. <gasps> so it's going to show that final moment probably and then be like, give me control. And then she's like, yo, save Barry. And she takes control and saves Barry. Oh, Excuse me. How fucked up would it be if, like, they added it also that, um... But, like, not only, um... Like, okay, so for whatever reason, you can't see the postcard and you can't see the, um... Like, you can't see the postcard and you can't see the, uh... Like, any extra... Oh, fuck. Shit ass. Max, you should say something a little more classy and a little more, like, mature for your age. Titfa. You let me do the looking now? <laughs> me control. It's like, no. I don't want your help. I can't find you myself. I am freaking fast with you. Probably just a game of the window. Mm. 
Ah. I thought I was gonna turn the other way. Okay. I'm gonna have to follow it on the right side. I'm gonna have to fall right behind it. Get to the right side. Okay. Why don't you let me do the looking now? Give me control. I don't want your help. I can find her myself. Yeah, with you, it's just a game of moving fast enough. can't imagine like actually like my senses warbling this much okay. uh, I have to be basically on your ass Gotta run. Thank goodness my basic walking and running is so quiet. Shit. This might be something I just have to. I might just have to smoke on this. Because, like, how else am I supposed to get around this? Turn right this time. We're fine. Shit! What the fuck? Do you want to rest? I know this can't be easy. I won't give up. Hey, I'm a tough little girl. Fuck you. Shit. Okay, so. Oh god, this one back too. Oh fuck my life. Okay. That's where Natalia has to go. Shit. It'll be easiest just to throw a smoke grenade in that bitch. Wait a second. This is where this is the first place that her and Barry went. Speaking of need a smoke grenade. What am I going to do about his ass? Okay, so we got two of them in a merry-go-round here. We got this one is looking at this wall, so it's basically like double stopping, going against the grain of the merry-go-round. So the way I see it, Okay, their pattern does not quite compute. They have two distinct patterns. One just goes around the tree, and uh, nope, it just goes right back and forth like that. Alright, so I'm in here, right? Hey, Natalia. So I think the best course of action is going to be to throw a smoke bomb here-ish, like in this area, and just book it. Like, literally just book it through. And just pray that that guy ain't looking to the right. In fact, now might be the perfect time to do so. I I wasn't. I was not seeing a way around that. Yeah, there's, I, I was not, not seeing, I was not I seeing a way to get around that anymore. shit. I don't want to be sad. I think if death had missed away, Let's see. If nice. You let me in. You just have to trust me. I don't know you. You're not me at all. I want Lottie. Why won't you make this easy? Yeah, that's how friends talk to each other. Just so you know, that's how that's how friends talk to each other. 
whenever I whenever I talk to my friends, I'm always like, you you guys are just bitches and you should just let me in and fuck you and no one likes you and you're the worst person. Body. I'm coming. Look at all those bodies that you could definitely Body. see from here. <laughs> Wee! I don't think I can go out any longer. Wee! I want to die. But there's no zombies on the beach. Wee! <laughs> the sweet embrace of death. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, the disease in general? I mean, cold pox, smallpox is infe uh, infectivity, or whatever you want to call it. Infectiousness rate? Cold flu infections rate? Makes sense. Body. I don't think you were that red earlier. Maybe it's because you're brand new. Oh wait, this thing actually does. Yeah, obviously I shouldn't be rough on it, but um, fun. It does actually go like, ah, oh, yep, here we go. Here we go. And next time, you won't see me coming. What the fuck was that? How the heck are you here? Lottie's the devil now! <laughs> that explains... A boat. That explains Barry coming over and being like, Whoa, little girl, hey! I'm here, baby. Please be alive. I love Barry. Barry's great. I want to know what happened right at the end, though. Times found a 20... All right, not bad. Okay, so is there a... Was there a cheat? Was there like a... Okay. Hmm. Ah, uh, okay, I got a question. I got a, I got a question. Rewards? Oh, it's saying like new ones, okay. I got a question. Okay, I... I think now's a good spot to end the episode, but I got I got a question before we leave this game. Before we before we mosey on. Hey, I just want to see if I can like watch a cutscene. Um doesn't matter what I spent them on anymore. I would have 45,000 G's, so I, I'd probably like do this and then Maybe a charge attack. No, actually, I, I, I would. Yeah, yeah, quick knife is fine. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I'm good. I'm happy. I'm, all right, okay, so I want to see something real quick. I want to see something real quick. Um, is there extras? Records? Gallery? Movies. There we go. Okay, so why is, doesn't my scroll work? That annoys me. Yeah. Another chance. My name is Moira. Transcend despair. Yeah, right, right. Okay, so I want to look up. Okay, hold on. Resident Evil Revelations 2 list of movies. They're not in order. <laughs> Just, they are not in order. Well, okay, we'll just have to figure it out. Okay, uh, Hope. Okay, so, hang on a second. So, Transcend. Okay, so let's look at Transcend. Transcend is a cutscene during the very segment of Metamorphosis, the fourth level of the game. Plot. Uh, or complete their journey throughout Alex West's mansion, meet the crazy overseer in the underground, and fear's attempt to destroy Natalia. 
Uh, oh, perfect. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, there it is. So, with heavy heart, transcend, despair, hope. So, what's hope? Finding our way an epilogue two years later. Yeah, so what's that? Hope. Wait, there's a good ending? What the fuck? There's a good ending? What's the good ending? Resident Evil t uh, Resident Evil Revelations 2 good ending. What the fuck is the good ending? Oh, uh... Ah, uh, okay, yeah. Uh, that I do remember as well. Thought that was kind of a funny concept. Alright, so bad ending. To obtain... Oh, shit. To obtain the bad ending, you must choose a certain action episode through judgment. During the boss fight, the end of Claire's campaign, after seemingly killing Neil, both Claire and Moira will be pulled from the elevator by the still moving mutant Neil. The boss will then collapse on top of Claire, knocking her gun away. If you perform the next time, the next quick time button tapping as Claire and grab the gun and kill Neil, you will send motion the events to the bad ending. Well, what the fuck? That's that's a arbitrary as shit. At the end of Claire's campaign, episode four, Moira will be trapped in the rubble, and a brief scene will show her succumbing to her fear and dying as her bracelet flashes red. So I was right. Uh, this means the final boss episode for Maris will end in the laboratory, and the mutated monster Alex will knock Barry aside and kill Natalia, thereby activating her dormant consciousness of Alex Wesker's... of Alex Wesker implanting Natalia. Natalia will then kill the mutated Alex and become the new Alex, with Barry unable to shoot. Um, okay, let's let's close this game, because we don't want it, we don't want to... Actually, wait, let's go into options. We'll just go into audio, and I'll just, um... Yeah, let's make it silent. Okay, so how old are you? 300. Okay, so. Previously on Revelations 2. Okay, so. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, okay, there, there. So. Okay, well, hold on. Okay, so, um. Good ending. To obtain the good ending to the game, you must choose the opposite action episode through judgment. During the boss fight at the end of Claire, do not try and grab the gun during the quick time event, tapping an event against Mutiny. Instead, switch to Mora and start slowly moving towards the gun. Mora will see various flashbacks to the instance where she accidentally shot her sister Polly. Overcoming your fear, Mora will grab the gun and kill Neil herself because this event will not change. Uh, at the end of Claire's episode, Emerald will no longer be shown to come into your fears and die under the rubble. This time, when defeated, Alex in the laboratory, Mora will appear to shoot Alex before she. Wait, wait, wait. Mora will no longer be shown to come into her fears and dying under the rubble, and the events of her rescue and survival are shown in the... Barra, uh, Barry, Mora, and Natalia will escape laboratory with a newly mutated Alex pursuit. Claire will show up in a helicopter to provide sniper support, but... Well, okay, well, I'm just gonna not worry about that. Um, okay, hold on. So, Resident Evil Revelations 2, Moira kills Neil. Let's watch that real quick. Fight with Neil. Uh, videos. Here's my resignation tro trophy. Okay. Don't care. Thank you, Powerpix. All right, so. Thanks. So that's. Oh wait, no, 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 no. I want. I want to see. Okay, hold on. Okay, hold on. Where did we go wrong? Wait, so this shows Claire doing it. This is this is what we did. Okay, so that's not quite right. Um Okay, so. Where did we go wrong? Okay, there. Okay, so. I want to watch this.
Go jump on a dildo? Uh, I feel like you could do a little better than that, Moira, but very well. Nah, shit, you broke Claire's spine. Why'd the audio go away? Why'd the audio go away? Nah, it just went silent. It must have, the recording must have bugged out when, um, they did that, when, uh, the Achievement King customer popped up. It's weird. Alright, so let's watch, I want to watch this. Yeah, obviously we'll skip ahead a little bit. Okay, there we go, okay. So... Yeah, look at him, well-stocked and reasonable. Meanwhile, I got lucky as shit with that. Okay, so I, I want to watch this before we end. <laughs> ah shit fam gotta reload <laughs> I'll keep shooting <laughs> I will say, I don't like that that's what triggered the good versus the bad ending, because this would have felt way more satisfying. This would have felt so much more satisfying. I'm turn the volume up a little bit. The video's pretty quiet. But, um, this, this would have been way more satisfying. They should have made it so that you couldn't use Claire at all. Like, Claire would immediately be like, I'm trying, but eh. So that way she has to do it, so it's one ending. Sure, it might be a bit campy, but I, I, I think that would have been, I think that would have felt way better. Especially because this next bit. Yeah, because her just winning like that, that's not fun. That just felt shitty. It was just like, wow, we're really going to leave this cliffhanger? Something's wrong. That's my girl. This, bitch. <laughs> there you go. Okay, once again, you could say it's obvious, but come on. Yeah. yeah! You cut your hair? great keep shooting now hang on let me take care of this I oh, shit about Magnum Browns oh, fuck oh yeah dad energy Oh, that's yeah. I'll cover you from the chopper. Yeah. So is this like another boss fight? I'm sorry, but like, come on, in the world of dad things, fuck yeah. God, just look at her. Oh, you have to play as her. God, I still love that he says she Wesker. Look at him just being a badass. I'm sorry, that line. That line delivery. That line delivery was freaking great, though. Of I'm a, I will always need you. Like ah, oh, it's so good. 
So this becomes a game of sniper then, I see. He just rolls the magnum. It's like, ah, oh, that was good. See, this is way more satisfying. This would have felt great. Oh, you... It's okay. It's okay, it's okay. Also, it, it's it's a nice little loop. Okay, good, good, good. You see him just walking there like nothing's wrong, folks. <laughs> yeah, okay, so. Yeah, so it's just a game of like you shoot as a sniper until there's no room and then like once she goes in to hunt, hunt you down, then you gotta then you gotta switch. Nice heal. Nice heal. Yeah, getting you. Oh shit! She stepped a little. Bu oh, so there's multiple paths you can take to to help stop that. Oh. She didn't cut her hair. It looks fine. I think the ponytail looked nicer, but that's just me. God, I love that thing's wiry design. It looks more mechanical than anything. Especially its spine, obviously, but still. Oh, oh, its organs are all hanging off. Yeah, do it. Yeah, its organs are like fall. Oh, it's gross. Oh, I love it. There you go, taking it and take it after Leon. Fuck yeah. Dead, 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 dead. Bitches. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. And in that moment, you felt fear. Oh, it's beautiful. Yeah. Yeah, that's satisfying. That feels good. There should not have been a bad ending in the first place. That, that's unnecessary. Like this should have been it. Resident Evil games should always end with an RPG. It's a blast. <laughs> oh, Barry. This is so damn handsome. <laughs> oh, from the from Alex West, or yeah. I mean, considering how much Albert did it. Look, yeah. Moira, I know I should have let you have your space. It's okay. I gave you plenty of reasons to worry. You held your own out there, Moira. For six months. Of course she did. She's a fucking Burton. <laughs> 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 Fuck yeah! Meanwhile, the little girl's like, hey! Fire! <laughs> so, what are you gonna do now, Barry? Use fire! <sighs> I'm gonna go back to being a fodder. That's really nice. There's Satan inside my leg. Do not get me near teddy bears. Do not. I repeat. Do not get me near teddy bears. Fucking hate teddy bears. Who taught you to say fuck? You did. Now that I'm a fucking Burton. Ah, oh, shit. That was really sweet. Oh, it's the epilogue. 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 God, that looks nice. So he's in China now? However, at this time, we are unable to find All right. any solutions to the large scale terror yeah. attacks that occurred. Well, tell Pierce to look after him. As well as the chat space of the South Korean Tall Oak. It's Helena Pierce, right? Going after Leon? Are they gonna get together? Dad, would you get your ass in here? Oh, it's from. 
Oh, it's for Barry. Oh, excuse me. Uh, Terra sent you. Hey, Polly, you see my jacket over there? Natalia, are you upstairs? Come on down and get ready. I figured you guys would want to be on the front. Well, I guess it's Terra save for... Terra save versus uh, BSAA, but... Cage went in search of a bird. And now, the bird is gone. The bird has changed. Oh. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, what the fuck is that? Oh, eh, eh, whatever. Yeah, whatever. Insect larva, don't give a shit. That felt like a much more satisfying ending. That felt great in comparison to the bullshit I had, where it's just like, and now we're dead. Okay, so overall, let's end the episode off here, but final thoughts. Final thoughts on Resident Evil Revelations. I think this game had a lot of really good ideas. There was just some different mechanics every now and then just didn't really gel right. Um, like I said, I don't think Heavy Wound... I, I like the idea of the Deep Wound, and I like the idea of Infectious, but those shouldn't be status effects with their own items. Just make them separate things. It's easier. Um, Moira should have been made more powerful. Either make the flashlight more powerful, but like you know, it takes up more juice... Because, like, you could sit there and hold the flashlight for a hot minute. Maybe make it so it's just, like, a flash. You know what I mean? So that way it feels more useful to compensate for that Natalia could do literally nothing, but Barry could do everything uh, in the little miss mode. Uh, make it so you have a second to succeed. It, basically, there was a lot of you should be more allowed to fail. And that's what I think with the struggle as well. You should have been more allowed to fail. And they should have made it so the guns and stuff like that are more obvious kind of a deal. Um, the game overall, I think the game overall was a great time. Like, it's great to see Barry. It's great to see Claire. Um, I, I, think it was, I think it was overall, like, a good game. It's just, I will say, it is a shame that to see such a big difference between normal and survivor. Because, like, you know, the survivor, bullsh the survivor moments where it's just like, and now you're fucked, you can't fight the enemy, GG. So you have to go to normal mode, and then, like, everything dies. Like, it's nothing. Felt kind of shitty. Um... Which one call it? I really didn't like Moira at first, but once she got better with her dad, I liked her a lot more. You can call that the patriarchy for me. That I'm just like, I just want you to love each other. But um, yeah. Overall, I think those two DLCs were fine. I I think it was fun. I think the whole good ending, bad ending thing is bullshit. It should have just been one ending. Keep it simple. Um. Other thoughts in the game. Uh, during the struggle, they should have made it so NZ, Eng, Eng, whatever his name is, should have made it so he could at least see weak points on, like, the revenants. Because that would have made it fair. 100%. That would have that would have been totally fine. I would have been able to work with it and win. But because I had to play... But because I had to guess, I you couldn't rely on the ammo for it. Um, the revenants in themselves are a fun enough enemy, but it really, with Barry, it's like, that, that's all there was. Well, I guess there's the invisible ones, but, you know, I'm always against instant kill. I'm always against instant kill things. But, um... Yeah, I'd say... I'd say overall, I had a good time. I, I had a great time with this. Um, I will prob... I would say, I imagine the co-op would be a bit weird. Because, you know, Moira... Uh, with Mora, it'd be more alright, but with Natalia, it would be a lot of just, like... That's the end of it. But, um... I think I said earlier that, like, I think I like Res... I think Resident Evil Revelations did a better... Okay, so 6 did a better job with co-op than 5. Would I say, um... Would I say that Revelations 2 did a better job with co-op than 6? I'm not sure. Probably not. Probably not, but maybe that's because 6 was a bit more complex and there's a bit more going on. But, um... I'd still say it did very well. I don't know for sure which I would say is better at it though but overall i think i think this was a fun and interesting story you know we got the Ouroboros again it didn't do anything too outlandishly weird you know what i mean like okay so revelations the first revelations was weird without using the flames or reverse yeah. you know it was without a doubt weird i'm not gonna pretend it isn't but it was fun it was fun and it felt silly and campy kind of a deal this felt like I just Barry's a great character. I'm glad to see more of him than just like the 
than just like, oh, what all games does Barry show up in? Hold on, oh, really? I almost typed in Bulbapedia. Resident Evil Barry. Yeah, Barry Burton. What all games did he show up in? Okay, so Rev 2, Merc 3D, RE5. He shows up in, shows up in RE5? Where is he in RE5? Where is he in RE5? Um, um, update set on Canada. Um, where, where is Resident Evil Five Barry? Was he, like, just mentioned? Oh, mercenary mode. Ah, okay, okay, okay. I was gonna say, like, how does he show up in that? That's what I was but, um, yeah, last Resident Evil. I really like him as a character. I, I, you know, this, this probably has something to do with, you know, Max is getting older, he's thinking about getting married, and someday I'm gonna want to have kids. It's probably gonna be sooner rather than later, so I'm relating more and more to father characters. I can take a step back and acknowledge that. But, um... Why come they didn't give me achievement for episode four? It's weird. I just realized that. Uh, clear episode one and okay, so it's invisible mode and invisible mode. Bet 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 bet. Complete both routes through the landfill and Barry's episode four. Well, I don't remember that. What does I don't remember really worried about it. But um. Who do I call it? Yeah, overall, I I had a great time. I just had a, I just had a good time with that. I had a good time with this, and I just like to say thank you everyone so much for watching. I hope I hope everyone had fun with this as well. I, you know, I'll admit there were some bits that I like got mad and complained about, but it, you know, that's fine. It's the nature of the game. Will we do the raid mode? Uh, I'm gonna open it right now just to see what it is to see if I can get a vibe. Sure. Um. So what's next after this game? So next. Oh, that's right. We need to pull up our Wikipedia. Uh, I'm I'm not actually looking to start this. If it puts me in like a lobby, I'll boot out. I just want to I just want to see. And shine, my adorable little guinea pig. This is my baby, the Red Queen Alpha. I've invested a lot of time into making this the perfect battle simulator. And now it's time for you to show me what it can do. Run What? Uh. I gotta be. I guess this is multiplayer to a certain extent. So it's just a series of I just want to see what this is real quick. Three thirty-eight enemies routed. I think this might be another case of if I really like this game. If I really like this game, level one. Yo, know, if I really like this game and I was like having a really good time with it. Which, not to say that I don't, but like I have other Resident Evil games I like to move on to. You know what I mean? Yeah, I have other Resident Evil games I like to to play. But yeah, it looks like it's just uh, 
it looks like it's uh, just a combat challenge mode. I imagine there's like a difficulty. It seems like they're not giving me any additional ammo. It seems like I kind of just got what I got, you know what I mean? I don't know, should I like... I think I would count it like a... Oh, you have to find the area key too and... We're in a snowy area, so this is like unique map too and everything. And I think I saw in the DLCs there was different stuff specifically for raid mode. They finally are giving me ammo, except they're like, you've used your gun perfectly. So no need. This music is positively jamming though, I must say. Like this music is just bopping. I'm gonna go back, grab that ammo. Wait, why am I doing this? I'm not even gonna finish it. Yeah, so if, you know, obviously we have more Resident Evils to play, but if I didn't have more Resident Evils to play. Yeah, but anyways, okay, sorry. Before you leave, just to, just to answer your question, resident, yeah, sorry, because I need to go to bed as well. You're asking what is next? That is a map from Mario 6, oh shit. All right, so next up, we're not doing Umbrella Core, we are doing Resident Evil 7, which I'm really excited about. Unfortunately, I will say, I have some knowledge of that game, I think forever ago, I watched a playthrough of it, but that was a long time ago. So I will say there will be some things I'm spoiled to. That doesn't mean for a moment that I remember every single detail. You know, I don't remember absolutely everything, but are there are some basic story beats that I do know, which is unfortunate, but I've never played it before. Because when I watched it, that was at the time where I didn't think I was going to do a Resident Evil series at some point. So how was I supposed to know, right? Um... Wait, what? Sorry, I'm seeing, like, Devil May Cry and stuff here. So, so I'm just like, wait, what the fuck? But, um, nope. Next is Resident Evil 7. That's going to be on Friday. This Wednesday, or Friday, maybe. It depends on what's going on. This Wednesday, though, is, um... That raid mode looked really intensive. I really wonder if you, like, if it is a single player, if you can get multiplayer people into it. Because that could be a fun time. But, um, uh, this Wednesday is going to be Tales... Yes, thank you. Tale, uh, Tales of Arise, which um, which one call it? We're in the third king. We're in the third kingdom now, and I'm trying to get a paladin and his girlfriend. So, all right. Uh, announcement for on Facebook, Twitter, probably on Discord because I suck at social media. VOD this will put you to relatively quickly. I am behind on VODs, like really behind for YouTube. So um, I'm working on that. But uh, I tried to upload like six at once. My computer was not having it. So I might need to you know work on that a little bit. But um, yeah, that was. That little raid mode was fun, and I enjoyed I enjoyed Revelations 2 a lot. But yeah, have a good night, Joe. Thanks so much for hanging out. I really appreciate it. But, um... Yeah, and then Reverse. We don't know when Reverse is going to come out. But, um... The thought process is... The thought process is next up will be 7, 2, 3... And then eight, all of which I am extremely excited for. I, I'm, I'm really excited to see how they're gonna go, because you know that what we call Revelations two that was from like what five six years ago, so this is like more like the modern day, if you will. So I think it's gonna be, I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. But anyways, um, let me put this here. Anyways, I think we have everything good. Yeah, let's end the episode off here. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all have fun. I know I did. And I will see you then. All right. Thank you for coming. Bye. Boop.